Hello, hello, hello everyone, hello, 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 hold up, uh, how do you do this again? <coughs> hello, oh, uh, hold up, no, I need, I need text to speech, I'm gonna go insane. Uh, this one, yes, use this garbage, thank you. So today, <clears throat> today we are going to work on the SL translation magismo, and it's not SCP SL translation magismo because we might have a copyright issue there. But SL translation magismo or SL stands for simply luxurious. Anyway, <laughs> hold on. I haven't done these streams in a very long time. And a lot of things changed. Firstly, you can actually download the app. So that, that that's nice. And the code is now finally available online. That's also nice. Super localization and translation magismo. Exactly. Oh boy. So let me show you what we are working with today. Uh, except I'm gonna first change the playlist. I'm gonna mute my phone and make sure it won't give notifications. No, it won't. Thank you. Mm, music is... Yeah, I think that's it. Uh, welcome to the translation not responding at all. Please, could we... Thank you. Uh, yeah, thanks. Thank you! Now, we shall demonstrate. In its current form. <gasps> we have a list of... You, you see, we have this good list. You see, it's very nice. Uh, ignore this. Uh, it, looks, it looks very nice, I think. And we can now file open. A translation minus... No. Translation 2. And as you can see, everything is actually populated. We go to teams, it's this. We go to item categories. We go to items and press on... Uh, not this one. Uh, if we... Uh, not this one, hold up. Uh, if we... Oh, you see, we have, we have text! And we can select things right here and they will auto-select there. And if we just hold up... And if we collapse everything and go to somewhere like main menu... Where is it? Main menu, the Steam authentication, you can see how it's all dynamic. Ah, I love this! But anyway, we are not working uh, on this today. My main goal for today is to make... Uh, you see this text right here? Well, I would like it to actually say something. Or more specifically, I would like, to, I would like it to say the original translation, which the original translation means... Well, any translation you want, <laughs> pretty much. Because when translating, well, you need to somehow know how the original looks like. So, <laughs> that's actually what's gonna happen. I'm not sure how you will change which translation this place, but currently, the plan is, the idea is this. Paint. Oh, that's weird. Uh, the idea is this. There is a, fo actually, no, no paint. I am talking about files. This is... I, I can explain this with folders. Uh, we have a... Uh, sorry, could I please close this? The application knows... Superior get paint out net. Nah. Uh, we have uh, this. What is this? Anyway, uh, we have the translations folder and it just looks for every single translation that it sees here. And then it adds it to like a cache. Or, sorry, not a cache, but it loads it into the application. So when you actually, uh, so when you want to preview something, it's just as simple as switching it inside the app. However, importing from SL is a little bit... Uh, what's the good way of describing it? Uh, awkward. So, the idea is to instead, once we actually load this thing, save it to a different folder, like a cache, which you can see right here, wabam. Bible. Uh, 
and then load it from here. However, now when I'm thinking about it, no, I don't actually care. It, my problem that I'm seeing right now is that there might be a small problem with versions, but now when I actually look at it, it seems like that's not something we can fix that easily. Eh, whatever. You know what, if you're a true translator and you really want to dedicate your, make this application your entire personality, you will probably set up a different folder instead of using the SL one. That's just probably gonna save you time. Now, I've managed to make it so that it actually loads the file and caches it and saves it and loads from the cache instead of importing from a cell every time. But, um. It doesn't do anything. It's even loaded in the app. Like, seriously. It's not even. It's nowhere. Here, files. Do we even do anything with them? No, we don't. So, files that add name, file. Congratulations, we at least stored them somewhere because right now we just loaded the, loaded the translations and didn't really care. Uh, we can collapse settings because we don't need them. Show, no. If I go insane. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Well, I guess we are done. This is defined in a... Oh, crap, I have it in, on a different monitor. Uh, this is defined right here. So, now we, to, we, need, we need to force the inspector of the array. Array. The inspector is this panel on the right side, right here. So, what is this? I've never seen this button. You see this? Uh, we need to force the inspector right here to load these things. But first, we need a way to actually select them. Ah, this is getting annoying. Like, it's getting complicated. I don't want to make a toolbar. However, we can make a... Oh. On the top, you can see these things. This is called the top bar, or at least it's called by me. We could make, like, a preview item, and I think... That's never like a good solution. Most applications over time they eventually move it to a separate dialogue. But I think it's gonna be good enough. Ah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's gonna be good. So we need the GUI. Or actually, no. First, I have an idea. <gasps> we are gonna shut up. We are. We're gonna do a public void. We're gonna make a method for selecting them. Public void. Or change current. Yeah. String name. F. Sorry, files. There should be translations. Translations contains key name, or more precisely, if it doesn't, then the current translation will be equal null. And we shall also make a public uh, public event action that we're gonna call on change current. Yay! Whoopsie. I have an even better idea. We go in here, we make, we, we instead of storing it right here, we store it somewhere else. Yeah, like this. And then, instead, we use this method as a, as a sorry, we use this thing that if you want to get, you will just return. Ah! We will just return this. However, if you want to set it, yes, we will set it for you. Oh, whoopsie, I forgot this one here. However, we will also call the on change current event, which uh, what do you want? <gasps> I know it's gonna ah, it requires a value. When we when when we have the value, then everything will work. So we just need to now we don't need to write an additional line of code. We can just go here and just return. <laughs> it's as simple. And uh, if it does exist. If it <coughs> if it does exist, then 
current translation will be equal translation uh, translations name and it shall work first try or actually yeah it will however th it's not gonna work because we are not using it anywhere so we need to put it on the top bar and for that we need a separate script if we go to project gui we have a certain folder called top in which we shall make a uh, what is this piss off we shall make a we're gonna call it top menu comparison that sounds weird like i call these things comparisons because well you're comparing the file that you're writing with the original translation how are we gonna do it or maybe preview no but the preview is dedicated for the main middle panel that's the preview if you think of preview you think yes that's the preview what do you call this thing this is the preview so what do you call this thing what do you call this gray thing here This is getting confusing. You call it original translation? Yeah, but we're not gonna have an entire item called original translation, like holy garbage. Translation preview. No, because this is the preview. Ah, what's, ah, what's the cool name? I want the name. Text preview. Text preview. But that's the same thing. No, it cannot have the name preview. I forbid. It shall be named. The comparison? No, that's a dumb name. Original text. That doesn't say anything. Default translation. I think original translation, but that's a little bit longer. Ah, you know what, whatever, we can change the name later, it's like, we, it's not like it defines us, we define it, so we have full control over it. If we go into the documents and we navigate Just over name a. to... Generic menu, I don't want to rename you, piss off, we add... I think it's gonna be near view <gasps> or maybe view well, yes we're gonna populate the view <sighs> and then we fix our problems all of our problems go away view we can edit, edit the view that makes sense it makes hi. sense hi hello 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 append separator as we want to separate ourselves from uh, the mistakes of our ancestors append action What do we call it? We need a for each var item in. Hello. <laughs> manager dot comparison manager dot transition. Oh, wow. Yes, we shall name them like so. And we can do another thing that's gonna be really fancy. We're gonna say. Why did I sound different in the previous message? Doc, do you still have SCPSL clone files? Which one? Oh, I know, my clone. Yes. Anyway, translation manager item value. Yes. Low. Value. Low. <gasps> I have an idea. Why? Retrieve the name. 
Maybe we should do, where should we get a, where should we make a method for getting the name? I think for now we shall make it here. String get translation <laughs> name say file file. So it's gonna be really simple. String Eternal name, I don't know how to call it. Ah, it's confusing, it's me. Ah. Oh, no, 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 actually, no. I know, I know, I know, I know, I always know, I always know. <laughs> if file dot SL version. Well, yes. Our SL version. And we're gonna call manager that get version. Yes. This will give us the version that we are targeting with this file, which should be the newest, or what is the point of doing it? Ah, whatever, current version. Current version. SL version, SL version. Import, import or export, I don't know. No, 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 we do not export, we do not export. We stay focused. We are gonna... Locate the manifest file. Oh, but then maybe a manifest file should define a name like this. Mm, this is making me confusing. You know what? Whatever. We are not gonna care. Manifest. 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 Hello, manifest. Hello, manifest. Where is it? In translation, mappings, manifest 13.1. Manifest the name. That's what we want. So, what's gonna happen now is that we're gonna look at the entries and if it contains key f file entries entries try get value what happened we're gonna put the key right here oh manifest name it's gonna be hard coded for now I mean, secondly, anyway, hard coded, but wow, well, you know what, whatever. And then out of our value, if that's the case, you're gonna use value dot content, which will be the name specified by the name. And if not, we shall use value dot. Oh no, we should just use null, null. Ah. So now in here, we're just gonna call this lad, this hello, hello item.value. And if it's null, then we're just gonna use item.key, which is the name used for the file where it is stashed. And it's gonna be just good enough. Oh, we need the action, of course, of, of, obviously. Hmm. What shall it do? Oh, I know, I know. Manager current, no. Comparison manager dot ch change current item dot key and it shall now work. We shall be able to select. Oh, actually, no, I had a better idea. What more can we do with here? Drop down menu status. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, that is interesting. That makes me interested. That makes me interested. Doc, are you being held on gunpoint? No. They would never get me to such a state. Only true passion can get you in such a state. So, if it is selected... Yes, yes, that's what we shall do. do. Manager dot current... No, comparison manager dot current version. If it is equal to item dot key... No, value. Value. Then. We're gonna use... This is getting messy. We're gonna have to do, do it like this. Ah. Do it like this. Our status. Status. <laughs> status. Status. Mm. Status and then we close it like so. Okay. So if it is this currently selected transition, we were gonna make mark it as checked, and if not, we're gonna mark it as none. 
and it shall work like a charm. However, there is one thing I deeply want to change. I want to just drop that not open. Nah, nah, nah. I'm not such a simple man. I need to make this thing dynamic. Create menu shall be called here. And before this should be named with clear items. Obviously. And we shall remove it because that is pointless. But now when I'm wondering, I think there is a certain place where I already did this and I shouldn't have. Oh yes, exactly here. We shall not do it. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Now. It will be possible to select what we want. We go into view. We go. Huh? Why you no worky? Uh -oh. Why you no worky? Why you no worky? Why you worky not work? Ah, the bag and the log. Item. It should work, why doesn't it? It's like it doesn't even exist, everything is ignored. Like nothing been updated. View, nothing. Nothing. Silence. But why? We have a lot of these. What are we talking about? Unless we need to call this first. Wait, but we already do. Then that is pointless. And we ask this. Yes, we do. Then why doesn't it work? We need to attach to Unity. This will require a lot of... Patience. Even though it didn't back in the day. But the generic Atelo decided to change that because... For reasons unknown to mortal beings, we shall just trust him on his world. And he never lied to us. How come? It's loud. But then it doesn't. Mm -hmm. Name, name. Get file, get file, get file. What is this? Oh yes, that should work, that should work. Why doesn't it work? Why doesn't it work? Why it work not? I think should work right here. Why it doesn't is a question that is not something that I can answer that easily. Will you pause now? <gasps> it did. Okay, we shall go line by line. File exists. Does it exist? I think it does. Is there a load problem with this serializer? That only explains it. That's the Thank only explanation. Now. Good it luck with your project and your dwindling sanity. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna need it. Load. Hmm. Why you no work? It must be throwing an error here. And you think you can? Continue, 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 continue. Actually, no, wait, wait. We don't need to close. We don't need to close. Okay, read all text. Will you crash after that? It did, why? What's the path? That's the incorrect path. Then why is it using it? <gasps> See, that's the problem, that's the problem. It's path and not cash path, and these are Two different things. Yes, yes, because we need to load the cache and not the... Because the path is a folder and the cache... Path is not a folder. It's a file. It's a file created by me. Or by the creation of me that created it. So is it mine? 
ask the question. <coughs> what is this supposed to mean? You only have a single one and it's in a very horrible state. What? You can see it right here. Why is it using the wrong name? Huh. Why is it only using Katala? That's how it sound when using Katala. That's not a language. We made it up. What does this mean? Who is Katala? Now it's a problem with this lad again. View. Why you not work? Because we can clearly see that you do, unless we don't. Why would you do that to us? <gasps> I got a notification on my phone. Ooh, getting distracted. I don't care. Mm. Get translation name, or maybe there's something wrong with the name. Maybe there is. Maybe there is not. We shall check. We shall check and we shall check again. And uh, the result is... A lot of words. And maybe some of them are words that we cannot separate. Which would explain a lot. But we can support those. So, my game theory. Let's use this. As we don't need more, why would we ever need more? Worst case scenario, we can provide the correct wordings in SLTM. Yes. We will have to update them. But they don't seem to work anyway. Mm. But why? Why? You should work. That's what you're designed to do. Unless it's a status. I don't trust you. I don't know what that even means. What's a status? Blah. It was the status. But what is non then? Which shall, shall we use? Normal. Yes, that's the solution to our problems. Status. Status. Can we use uh, this thing again then? That would be nice. If our languages can separate that, and if not, then uh, we will run into a problem. And problems are difficult. So let's hope that does not happen. What is this supposed to mean? What is Katala Velenzika? Oh, it does the little slashy slash, and we don't like that here. We do not like that here. So, my solution. Oh no, you hear it here. Split. Oh no, a replace. We replace this symbol, it's a very dangerous symbol, with a this symbol. <sighs> actually no, because there is a small problem, so we need to actually replace it with a different symbol that's a... Like this. And our problems shall go away. Hopefully. I hope so. <gasps> Will it be selected? <gasps> it's selected. Oh, that's such a small little... Oh. <gasps> It's so small, little, tiny, little, manifest Jason zero. 
shall select manifest JSON zero. And select it. What is this supposed to mean? I don't know, that's not a word. At least in my opinion. I mean, you can disagree, but that's fine. That's how opinions work. Now, inspector. Aaron Tree Inspector, I don't think I labeled this properly. You can see this very difficult to see gray text because it's on a darker shade of gray, so it doesn't make sense here. Content comparison, we shall name it. Now, let's go. Oh, we shall go over to. Close all these things. They are pointless, they are useless in our endeavors. Inspector. What's the inspector name provider? Ah, that's a separate thing. Okay, don't worry. Single entry inspector. Yes, that's exactly what we need. Text field. Con Yay. So this right here will get us the element that, that we want and with it everything shall be shall be shall be, <coughs> shall be simple simple hmm. content comparison on the field set a value without notify i mean we don't really need to care about notifying but whatever we shall do as we think is good manager current version no comparison manager we're gonna make a cool cool thing right in here and i'll make a cool method called public string try get entry data Sounds like a good idea. Shrink ID. Now, current. If current translation will not be equal to null, and current translation entries will contain the key ID. we will return its content. But if that's not the case, we're just gonna return a null. Oh, Entry content data. Mm. Yes, that sounds like a lovely idea. Void update content comparison. I put it in a separate void for a very good reason, which I'm gonna go into details later. Var val <laughs> manager dot comparison manager dot get try get entry data. No, I said try. We need to try string out string 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 content. Content will be equal string dot empty. F current translation is equal to null. If it's not oh you know we're just gonna do literally this thing. And I copy this right here and paste it right here. And if that happens, we return true. We set content to data.content. Bull, sorry, apologies, apologies. And if that's not the case, then we're just and content content will be equal to string that empty and we return false because that was not successful. Bull exists. ID, what will be the ID? Entry the ID. If entry is equal to null, we don't care. Out string content. 
content. We set this content to this and we say content comparison the change display to exist because if it doesn't exist then we don't care. Yes, and content comparison field. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, void. No, no, no. Manager. It's current. No. Uh, what was it called again? Comparison manager. If unchanged current, if that happens, we want to update. However, if we are not selected, then we absolutely do not care. Minus, minus. And there we go. Simple as that. Let's remove this space to be extra nice. This will work now. So, if we select any entry, it shall disappear. <laughs> it's not there. However, if we change the translation to Galergo. <laughs> Do you see this? Do you see? Do you see? Radio. Do you see? Do you see the object that I step? Microhad armadura corporal. Let's change it to a mental illness. Pancerzy. Ha <laughs> ha! Pancerzy. 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 Let's change it to English. No, that's not the one. Let's change it to English. Ooh, radio. Radio. Based on SP containment. Preach. Good to know. Lovely to know. It is wonderful to know that. And you might think that is it. You might think that that is it. Oh, but it ain't. For reasons right in here. <gasps> it's broken currently, don't worry about the path. Okay, hold up. Let me demonstrate by loading a translation like this. <gasps> what now? We don't have a preview for this. What are we supposed to do? Worry not. I have an incredible idea. So, pretty much, to summarize, we place it here. And we separate it by new lines. Is that right? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Oh, that is a really good question. Am I right? Well, of course, I am always right. Let's look at something that's very long. I know, SP173 intro description. That is long. That is so long. Why is it F00? That is weird, because it is red. It's red. They capitalize the Fs. SCP-173 is horrific appearance commands attention, becoming extremely deadly when it isn't observed. The sculpture demands a witness at all times. I am happy. <laughs> also, I would like to change original to the name of the translation. If I may, of course, if I may. Which now, speaking of which, maybe... I know! Comparison Translation Manager. We will use a class, public class. Of course, that makes sense. Public safe fight. Fight piss off, Mr. Discord. 
Or maybe I should look at it. <gasps> I know. I should firstly change the webcam. Disable sec one Discord because I have a lot of Discords. I'm a Discord lad. I'm a lad. I shall collapse Discords just to be sure. And now we shall return in peace. Now I pause the music. That's not the key I wanted to press. I'm going to press 2. And now I have 12. Public save file and public string display name of the thing. Uh, and instead of here, instead of saying save file, we say no, 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 mi bueno, no, no, friend, no, 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 no. We instead create a new thing. File is equal file. And display name is equal a very complicated process that we shall copy from. Top menu view, which you see right here, or right here. Hello, hello, hello. <gasps> so now we don't need this. This is pointless. It's pointless. What is this supposed to mean? <laughs> Item dot value dot display name mm. works as simple as that. And now in single entry, manager no. Not here. <clears throat> Instead here. No, in, uh, here. Content comparison field dot. Crap, what is called? Label. Label, yes, of course. It's called a label. Mm. Manager. Of course. Makes absolute sense. Why do I have Steam opened? Bye bye. Bye bye. Can I target texture? Oh no. What am I going to do? Anyway. Uh. Oh. Of course, obviously. How could I be so blind? What does it say in here? Maybe not. I don't know. Try get entry data, current translation. Just to be sure. Just to be sure. I always like to be sure. It doesn't work. Fantastic. Oh, I know. We should save this. Of course. Mega Gallego, 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 I know, I'm going to clean it. Hmm. When we change this thing in here, 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 here. We're gonna do a little thing called... Man, I hate QAs. But and on another thing, change option. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
settings settings right here we need another setting uh, by the way don't look at how these things work because they are horrible i hate them the passion i despise them comparison target i don't know i'm gonna call it name what no oh. Current name. In here, current name. We're gonna change this to a string and this to a string. And in here to a string. On settings change, what does this do? I forgot Hang already. On. Hello, hello, hello there. What does this do? What does it do? What does it do? What does it do? Check and import transition. Oh, but we do not want that. We do not want that. No, 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 no. We say no, 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 no. We use the name. Comparison name. Let me change this value to name. We don't care about the rest. And it shall save and remember. Right here you can see that... This is even work. Right here you can see the thing that should work. And I hope it does work. Because if it doesn't work then that's, that's, not, that's not okay. It should work, right? Doesn't it work? But it will work. If we go into view translation and we change this to English, then we will see that... Well, coding, what type is that? Yes. I know coding. What type is that? Which... which... which type of which? What? This is a... C. Java Python or... C. Sharp. We are making Unity today, sadly. Nobody likes Unity. Oh, hello, Lamp. How is it? I hope I didn't disturb your day. This works. Wow. Okay, so what about... What about entries? Because, well, uh, my original idea was amazing, of course, but I think it's flawed, mainly due to the loading... Uh, the loading, the loading thing. Hold up, I'm gonna tell you what's going on. Open recent translation two. T. If we go into connection loading hints, you can see a lot of this. Okay, seeing. No, I don't know. Great, hold up. So you're creating your SL. I'm translating SL. I need to check something. Entry. Uh, ah, it's not the one I on the. Uh, right here. I saw this thing called dynamic height. What does this mean? How much will it break things? That's what I would like to see. Let's load the recent file. Shut up. Let's load the recent file. Oh wow, it didn't break anything. Oh, that's lovely. That's lovely. That's lovely. So how about you created we... created that from blank? What? Okay, so to summarize, SL translation magismo. Application which you can download right now, by the way. I mean there are a couple of things broken, but that's not important. You created all of that. I've created a cell. Uh, <laughs> yes. This is a thing you can download. It's an application for making oh, translations to a cell. So for example, I would like to change how operational guide looks. I say it's gonna be called the tutorial, but it doesn't update because I broke something. Oh, it updates. Would you look at that? Why isn't it update? Oh, 
Ah, oh, because it's delayed field, oh, I need to change that. Uh, anyway, yeah, you can see we can translate things. There are different scenes that you can see, for example, lobby. Uh, so, well, very amazing job you done. Yes, I am. I am amazing. Uh, it, it, don't look at this too hard. Uh, it's uh, we will change. We will fix it one day. Uh, the preview right now doesn't really work, but what works is importing and exporting. For example, you can export to a CSV, which I could present a file to you. If only I would be able to manage to locate it. We can import and export CSV, which I think a lot of people will appreciate, or at least I hope. Oh, it's not open. Open. <gasps> hello, hello. But now what the difference? Holy crap. But now what the difference? What the difference between what? You can see this is amazing. Wait, why aren't you impressed? You can translate the, the, the original field isn't populated because we suck, but we'll fix that. Today. No, actually not today. I am too lazy. But we'll fix that one day. It's gonna be on our very long list of features. Between SL and SL fake from you. This is not an SL fake. This is a trans... This is an uh, application for translating SL. Because SL's translations are horrible. It's impossible to locate anything. You don't know where, they, where anything belongs. Well, that. And... What more? Okay. Just to tell you how much SL's translations are messed up, let's look at a file like main menu. You can see all of these things are normally populated by text, which you could waste hours translating and it never gets loaded by the game. But it's not like, oh, okay, main menu file is a file that's no longer used. No, it is used for this, this and this. These three things. SL's translations are horrible. Uh, okay, you're right. So this application organizes them into something that's actually understandable to man. Which we'll be able to see right here. Holy garbage. And how will you play with that? Expand. This application, why doesn't this expand? That's really quirky and strange. You can see that this everything is categorized into categories and it's, it's somehow readable. You know what, what thing belongs where. And you see a live preview. So if you're one of those people that make their own custom translations, that's a... You know, modify the game in some very, very heavy ways. And the news updates automatically? Yeah, I showed it already. You can see like... You can see... ASD. I'm even gonna show you. If I go to main menu, where is main menu? Main menu, if I go to, for example, connecting to centrals, everything updates when, whenever I select it, I can translate this to instead of create server, it's gonna be now. What, what is it called today? now? I forgot. Rent server. Wow. That's the, that's the point of the application. We cannot translate that because I forgot to do that. But yay, version 128.7.0. Isn't that lovely? Now, where did we left off? We need to figure out how to make... Array. Oh. Put an Easter egg somewhere. Oh, that will definitely happen. Oh, that definitely happened multiple times. Oh, trust me. However, the preview panel is quite bare bones because it doesn't have many scenes. It only has four. Sort of. We are currently trying to get the main functionality and when that's done, we're gonna work on the thing in the middle. But right now, translation previews. Where did we left off? We left off with the array entry inspector. Inspector, inspector. Content list dot unchanged. No, there is a thing we need to unbind item. Yes, that's exactly what we need to override. I used this somewhere. I forgot where. 
Hold up. Up here the blue list. This is a very complicated process, okay? This, I have to write all of this because uh, the unity is horrible. Oh, I see we're not giving it any leeway. <sighs> this is really... Hmm. That sounds like effort. Is there a better way to do this? Okay, so we are currently working on tr uh, translation previews or like comparisons. So you can see the original version, which will hopefully help you in translating in some way. So if I were to load the re the most recent file and go into vo voice, the oh crap. English. You can see that I can see the original version. Of course, this is English. So let's say we're translating from Polish. Uh, let's say. Or, or Pitskal. Or it says if Pitska, the Pitska says. <laughs> yeah. The problem is, there are things like the Alpha Warhead. Or, the, for example, the Micro HID room. I can see it's already being broken. Uh, but as you can see. Yeah, where do we squeeze this? We could put it on the bottom, which, you know, could work. But, the problem is... Where was it? Connection, loading hints, holy garbage, what is this? You know how much scrolling that would involve? So I need a better way, but how? And that's not a question to you, that's a question to myself. I have no idea how to, how we do this. You know, originally I felt like maybe there would be an ability to like hold down a certain key to just swap the content of this into to whatever you want. But that's annoying and not intuitive. How do we preview this? I hate this very much. You know what? I think for now. I, okay, this requires way too much thought put into it. So, I think we're gonna leave it for now. So, piss off. Right here, and... We are going to go into translation mapping... No, uh, well, I, I, I changed something. Oh yeah, yes, I know, document. Uh, inspectors. Array inspector. We need to disable dynamic height because it breaks everything. We're gonna fix that later. And I think we are done, or I think, hold up, there was a problem. There was a problem. Because we implemented saving and it doesn't save, you see? It didn't load it properly, why? It's ra, why are you not ra loading ra? Ra. Huh. Oh wait, hold up, I have, I might have an idea. That's how fish say, that's what fish say. A comparison transition manager. We save it here. Current name. But we don't use it. Or actually... Oh yeah, yeah, we just don't use it. So, what we are gonna do... He's gonna confuse. Hmm. Oh, I know, I know. Set current name. Change set. No, we need to firstly check and import translations, and then we need to change current to whatever this thing is. Okay, but then, since we are doing this in here, let's go to the translation manager and remove where is awake. We don't need to do it here anymore. And now it will work, just like that. Magically it will load itself. And it will be Russian. Like always. And... Works like a charm. So translation previews work. Which is fantastic. I love that. Now. We're gonna upload this, what are we gonna call it? Uh, translation co comparison. Added translation comparison. Anyway, now let's look at 27 bugs I've managed to find. And let's write the new ones. Uh, okay. Let's 
or something uh, collapse all not working on manifest uh, preview not updating due to delayed field I think that's it for now let's see so if I excuse me result here yeah, thank you uh, expand all and collapse all I'm telling you it works oh yeah uh, yeah sure thanks Okay, well, that's how we solve bugs, don't we? Okay, another thing. Preview not updating to the delayed field. That's a very simple thing to fix. I was testing something, and I've managed. I've, I've decided to set this as is delayed. However, we do not want that. So now, problem resolved. Now, if I select any other element in the preview... Actually, can I make this window bigger? Because we are not really using the editor that much. No, I can't because... Oh, thank you. If I select operational guide. See, it updates... It live updates. Nice. Lovely. Beautiful. And beautiful. No, I still need to work on this. Hmm. Upload preview responsiveness fixed preview not being responsive when editing uh, an entry. That's how we solve bugs. Another bug solved. Well, thank you. No, I'll piss off. Another problem cannot add a new item to empty array entry list. Oh, that's annoying. Uh, incorrect output file name of legacy interface. Well, that's a simple thing to do. So, turns out that there is a file called legacy interfaces, and you see how there's an underscore here. There isn't an underscore here, which is a problem because a cell has an underscore there. Where did it go? Yay! Simple as that. Simple as that because if we go into translations, we go into low legacy interface. You see, it's an underscore. So now, it's fixed, just like that. Upload le legacy interfaces mapping error. Fixed wrong name for output file for legacy interfaces. Something like that. It's, that's how he writes comments on GitHub. It, it, if it at least attempts to sound like a, something that human would say, good enough. Now, we have... Oh, this thing. Okay, so, what I've managed to find... Is that for some reason... When we go... Into, for example, metadata, we cannot add... A new entry. For some reason. However... If we go into... Beep there... Uh, if we load, actually, you know what? Screw it. We're gonna import from SCPSL English. Oh wait a second! I messed up my English translation. I forgot. Okay, never mind. If we import from uh, f France, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Imagine, imagine if that was your language. Your, that, your life would be sad. You see, what is this word? You see, we can add... Oh, never mind, we cannot add at all. Huh. I swear I was able to do that earlier. Okay, so adding just doesn't work at all. Uh, okay. Uh... Hi. <laughs> hmm. Didn't really expect that. <gasps> I got a notification on my phone, what is it? Don't care. So this is a GUI problem. Actually, it might not be. I'm gonna go, go into detail while, uh, why, but first, it might be an issue with GUI. 
Array in entry inspector. Unchanged. Well, that should work. I think. So, let's test it. Mark file 30. What is this? Hmm. Every single time it gets changed, we're gonna log how it looks like. String.join Content list.source Oh, we need another one of these. So now we're gonna monitor how the list changes when we press the add app button, because if it doesn't change, then that means that's a problem with the add button, and it doesn't do anything for some reason. However, I might have a different game theory. I know. But well, aren't I stupid? Well, that doesn't do anything. Nice. Why? Is the add button a portion? No, I don't think it is. Items that it has not been triggered, but why? It, why? What happened? I'm confused. I'll piss off. I know, we can just attach to Unity. Okay. So... We're just gonna... Ah, uh, what do you want? Oh, come on! Ugh. Hold up. We work now. Oh, come on! Hit the breakpoint! Ah. So is it just me or is the music too quiet? Why isn't it hitting the break? What is wrong with you? Why? Why do you keep doing you know what's screwed? We're just gonna it's gonna fix itself. We'll not be currently hit. Oh we'll see about that. Hold on, busy. For what? Come on! Come on, let me press buttons. I like pressing buttons. Buttons, Oh, I don't need this. Piss off. Oopsie. Uh metadata where well, we hit it okay so it says unchanged invoke so in that case this should also be hit unless entry is equal null which wouldn't make any sense how would you look at that it doesn't even work why yeah why lad uh, hold up what's going on here it seems like we are either we're setting the list at some point and losing connection with this one, or we're setting this, but that wouldn't make any sense. Huh. Hmm. You can see that unchanged will... Hmm. And the wake is never triggered, but that would not make any sense. Why would it never be triggered? Is there some... No. That doesn't make any sense. Unity? Unity? What are you doing? Well, it is triggered. Content list... The unchanged is equal to null and then we add it so now unchanged is equal to something why is it so slow yeah huh. 
<sighs> I'm really confused. This should work. Why doesn't it work? Like, add item. Why doesn't it do anything? Items added invoke. Yes. Unchanged. It's not empty. So what does it trigger? Because it doesn't trigger this. Why? What is going on? This doesn't make any sense. It should at least trigger something. Oh wait, that's the manifest inspector. Oh crap. Never mind, my game theory might still be correct. See, that's gonna be triggered. And it's gonna be triggered. So, now we can inspect. Entry content. It's nothing. But why? To entry content. So, my game theory was correct. Okay, so let me explain a little bit on how this application works behind the scenes. Let's not explain, let's go into the source. Uh, English. Yeah, why not? Yes. As you can see, behind the scenes, this application is pretty much just a collection of entries. An entry contains an ID, which represents the entry that it is, and content. And that content is your translation. Of course, in the future we can add more things, but for now that's it. But, as you might know, there are array entries, meaning entries that can have multiple items. And in here, we only have a simple string. So what's going on? Well, what's going on is a little bit of a tomfoolery. If we go into HID sign... Ah... It's in fact not micro... It's, it's not an array. It's instead a single text line, or text item, that is split by slash n, the new line characters. Which, of course, they are represented as slash n here, because if it was a new line, then it would just do, do this. Which would break this file, so that's why it doesn't do it. But, there's a problem. If we just put these things in between every item, then how do we know which one is the last? Because, okay, no, sorry. Let's now imagine that this is equal to nothing. Well then, technically, this is a single item. It's a single empty item. Because there is no difference between this and a single item that has nothing in it. If I were to write ASD, yes, that fixes things. But if we have a single empty item, it's technically saved the same way as an item that is... As an item that has an array that has nothing. So the solution is simple. We just put slash n after every single one of these items. So now it's quite simple. If there's a single empty item, then it looks like this. If there are no items, it looks like this. However, recently I've realized that this might not be that good of a solution because, for example, in CSV, if I were to export, if I were to edit for example, manifest authors. I would have multiple of them. So it looks something like this, I don't know. Uh, me. Oh, ah. Me, someone else. Uh, someone, one, one else. And suddenly me, as a user, as an unsuspecting user, I've just committed a crime. Because in reality, this looks you know, this looks normal to us, but the application will see it like this. The problem is here that suddenly we don't have that thing that ends this string of characters, if you know what I mean. So, for the serializer, it will see, oh, okay, there is an we just ignore the last item after slash n, so it will delete this. And suddenly, we just lost the man. It just deleted it. So the solution is simple. If the last item 
is not empty, well then we just load it anyway. We don't use that little thing that I just explained. We load it, we just split it normally. And I think my game theory is that I missed something with doing that. And there might be now a problem where it's just... Whenever we add an empty item, it still treats it as it's an empty entry. So there might be a problem with that. That's my game theory. So two entry content seems to be broken. Why? Good question. Oh, right here. Skip last. Why are we doing this? Good question. I don't know. This doesn't make any sense. No, seriously. Why Why are we doing this? doesn't make any sense. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? This doesn't make any sense. What? Was that literally it? It will appear like it's not gonna go in out without a fight. Oh no, hold up, I, I know. So, we are getting the last item. Okay, this makes even less sense right now. What is going on here? We get the last item. And we check if it's null, then we skip one. Why? Why? <laughs> Wait a second. No, if it's not null, then we skip one. Does, does, what? Hold up. No, this will never be null, because I know that's not how splitting works. Actually, no, it might be null. So, if it, it's not null... And... Shame is null or empty. Last. So if it is if it is a null, which will always be, and if it is empty, then we skip the last item, and that will fix everything. Wow. Twenty hours of lore and one actual minute of fixing the problem. Incredible. Never mind, why are you still not working? If it's not null, well it isn't null. And if it's empty, well, is it empty? Yes it is. Or is it? Wait no, hold up, I'm doing this the wrong way. We don't need to do any of this. I remember now. It's like a quality of life thing, which basically, if the last entry is not empty, then we just don't do that formatting thing that I talked about. Just for the sake of clarity. Uh, that That is not how it's supposed to work. Okay, so if the last item doesn't exist, so if this entry has zero items, then we just return an empty array. Just a simple string. And what we're gonna do it in a different way. Array.count is equal to zero. Return string that empty. It's an empty array. We don't care. If it's not, and if the last item is empty. If the last item is empty, then we return String dot join. String dot empty and array dot select. Oopsie. X slash n. And if it's none of these, we just export it as normal. Oopsie, hold up, I need last. Actually, we can just. Yeah, just like that. If it's empty, we need to add that single thing at the end. Or even better, you can do it uh, even differently. Uh, var uh, content will be equal to string.join all of these. 
and if this is not equal null or empty I mean if this is empty if the last thing was empty we need to mark it that it's empty and we just return this okay now it should work holy garbage I had to actually go out of crazy today <laughs> I need to drink water I'm talking too much which is good for you I hope. Maybe you understand. I don't know if you understand. Tell me if you don't understand something. Or don't tell me if you're too scared I'm gonna babble on for longer. Uh, metadata. It keeps... It's just that easy. Upload. Array. Entry. Content. Fix. Fixed array. Entry. Content. Fix. Uh, what? Fixed array. Entry. Uh, content. Array. Entry. To. I'm sorry. Fixed array. To. Entry. Content. Deleting. Last item. Well, that was a doozy. Holy crackers. And that removes the last thing on our... This is broken and it's... It's broken? Oh no. Hmm, okay, what exciting thing. It's 7.23, okay, we still have a some time. I actually did everything I wanted to do on this stream, so that's nice. However... I think we should work on something, and what that something will be, I have no idea. We could make a preview scene, so I would actually show you how it looks like, how how that process looks like. But and I have a list of oh, not that one. I have a list of a recent entry right here. It's important to us. Like, you see a lot of settings and loading. Uh, but I think we're gonna save that for another stream. I think today, the update that I'm working on, I want to make CSV importing and exporting be a lot better than it currently is. And to do that... Well... We will need a, 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 a... We need to close all of these. And import and export CSV. There are a couple of things I want to do for CSV. CSV is the format used for exporting to spreadsheets, which uh, it's a very common way of editing games. Trust me. And uh, oh, other transition preview. Oh, we can mark that off. Remove spaces too. No shortcuts be preferences tab. What? No. Make CSV import for you better. That's annoying. Better CSV export. Yeah. How to detect CSV import. Uh. <laughs> yeah. So, exporting. One thing I want to do. Currently, the raw original does not do anything. This item. Useless. String empty. The doing talent is after we, we start supporting previewing. We support previewing! Let's do it! Let's do it right now! <laughs> String. So, manager. Put comparison manager. Put get. Try get entry data. ID is hierarchy item.id. Out string content. If we get that content. We do this. If we don't, then... Oh, crap, not that one. Uh, so yeah, now it should work. So if we now export to a spreadsheet, which... Let's close this one. Let's close this lad. If we now open up and we export to .csv, it should work. Hopefully. Export to CSV. Uh, 
Yeah, let's put it in I over there. Expert. Now if you go into Uru. We go into translation.csv. Yeah, 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 whatever. Holy crackers, that's a very big one. Uh, but yeah, we can see we've exported the Russian original translations. Of course, we can make this slightly smaller because we... Oh, crap. <laughs> Yay, Russian. Oh, we change it to English. I don't save. If we change it to English, and we also import uh, import SCPS, so let's import the Polish translation, because I can understand that. It doesn't use that weird characters. And now when we export to CSV, it's the same place, sure. You can see that GeForce Experience, press Ctrl Alt P to use GeForce Experience in game overlay. Wow, we're gaming. You'll be able to see that now we can actually edit like this. Of course, it, there's a lot of things you can do to make this more, you know, viewable because right now it's a little bit annoying. But yeah, that works. Yay! Yay! Translation. Brak kart dostępu. Przedmiotów medycznych. Ra... Rad... Ha, ha. Rad you... That is not how you... Okay, I'm really confused. So this is translated more like Ray. Uh, this is translated in Polish like there are zero radios. I swear this is not how you spell radio. Seriously, that's how you spell. What is it like in in it's in the file called category, but it seems like it's a very specific wording for a very specific place. Why this? Is the, I hate this. Word. Holy crackers. <laughs> Istavienia. Let's copy this one, paste it here. Yes, settings. Przewodnik. No, we need operational guide. Ugh, media społeczności. How do you even fit? Holy garbage. So yeah, CSV works. You can see how you can use these things to ignore the next uh, thing. The, the, the next row. That's what we do, because uh, we, we use that so that uh, we can add like... We can name these things. So we'll know and make values. By the way, very funny thing in SCP-079 somewhere. Uh, uh, uh. I have ma I've managed to find a, a, a typo. It's in the this, this, this saddest I think place of all time. Okay, I found it. What is this? Presentage. Oh, crackers. Presentage. This is the actual ID that's used for replacing part of a text with the, well, percentage. You've gotta be kidding me, Northwood, I hate you. You don't even check your translations. I'm doing more work than you do. Holy crackers. Uh, okay. Upload. What are we gonna name it? Uh, CSV comparison, comparison translation added a way to compare translations in CSV export. Oh no. Added Translation comparison to CSV export output. I don't know. Okay. Oh man, uh, and importing doesn't really need any changes right now. 
ها 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 Better CSV export Make CSV import better preview Okay, so Another thing that's, kind of, that's a problem with uh, SLTM Is when importing CSV The process is blazingly fast However However I can tell you, uh, CSV It will lag a little bit Doesn't res it's not responding, it's not responding, it's not... It's responding. The reason why it takes so long, it's not because it's loading, no. It's because Unity is calculating all of these things when I'm adding them. So, the problem is that... Well, uh, These are all items in Unity, there's a lot of them. UI Toolkit is not really good for that. You can even see something similar happen when you load a file. Where it's not because the loading takes so long, it's because this thing keeps getting repopulated. So, how can we solve the problem of CSV import? Well, the solution is simple. We just kind of cheat. We don't need all of these items. Like all of these items. Because if you were to actually look how a program like LibreOffice uh, Calc does it, is that when I scroll, I'm not actually scrolling. I'm just like moving over to the next item. So it, instead of starting from 1, it starts from 52. But like you can see right here that if I scroll, like th it's not starting from the top. We are like halfway through item 12. These are like actual items. So we could do something similar and we could cheat. And when we move the scroll bar, we would actually just move the index at which we start reading the table. But there are of course some issues with that. Firstly, we need to know how many of these cells do we actually need. I thought I was gonna say something smart. No, I ha no, we actually need to do that. Uh, <laughs> and uh, second thing, scroll bars. I'm using scroll view, it's not really gonna work. That sounds like a very like a very annoying thing to do, but okay, I've already started talking about it, so let's do it before I change my mind. CSV import. And we could just disable preview, but that would suck. And we do not suck. We are amazing. Preview. So right now, it's a scroll view, but we don't want that. We instead want to make a different thing. Uh, uh, uh. How can I disable you? Oh, I guess I can't. Okay, so we just go in here. We name this thing a grid to automatically notify... What is this supposed to be? Hold up. It's a little bit small right now, but we can fix this by just... Huh? Okay, why aren't you expanding? Something wrong, something wrong. Why you no why you no work? What is this all this specific? Huh? Auto. Auto. Okay, UI builder is behaving quite weirdly. UI builder is just really weird, but Okay, maybe we'll manage. Auto. Why aren't you working? Ah! I should start fighting for the space with this level, but it just doesn't. It just gives up. So I think I missed something up. I'm getting really confused by this behavior. Hmm. 
auto, right? So it is fighting for the space, but this somehow has a bigger priority. Okay, no, just move it, just move it outside. Just piss off, piss off. Yeah, you go there, you go there, you stay there. We have one vertical scroll bar. You can just delete it, honestly, I don't care. I have one vertical scroll bar, that's gonna... Now, we set its position to absolute. From the bottom, it's gonna have zero pixels, right zero, and here zero. Oh, crap, not this one. Uh, left zero. Apologies, apologies. And it's also too big for some reason. Uh, no. Auto. Yeah, just like that. And then we duplicate it. But this one is gonna be vertical. Instead, we're gonna give it zero from the bottom, zero from the top, and zero from the right. It's gonna stay here, but once again... Why are, why do you keep doing this? Auto. Piss off. But we need to create a little bit of a space down here. Uh, I think it's gonna be five pixels, no. Ten pixels. Yeah. And from here, from right, we will take also ten pixels. And we have our preview. We're gonna name this preview. Preview, uh, scroll, horizon, or ah. horizontal. Preview, scroll, vertical. Yay! Its value is not gonna be 32. My dear sir, what are you smoking? Uh, neither here. Why are you doing this? Maybe zero, high value. Low value, what is this? Is words mean? You can see the handle is really small. I'm not actually too sure what we are supposed to. How can you change the size of the handle? That's what I'm wondering. Hmm. Something is gonna be complicated. Dragger, are you controlled by anything? If not, that, that will really, really suck. So don't do that to me. I think it's not. Oh crap. I think it's a problem with UI Toolkit. We need to change the style. You're right, perfectly honest. I think this is way more effort than it's worth. A discard, piece of. Good status. Hey, what? Huh. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're not gonna do that. I think it's way too much effort. This is potential features. Because you only export like once. I don't think there is really a point in doing this. Again, porting is something you do very rarely. Nobody cares that your application will lag. Huh. <laughs> Better CSV export, export. Well, that's what we already did, didn't we? Oopsie, not this one. This one. A shortcut preferences tab. That's a that's a potential feature. That's a, that's gonna be really complicated. Okay. Very interesting thing. This project is built on QASIC. It was a tool I was working on, but it wasn't finished, and it will never be finished because I'm working on a new version that's gonna be cross compatible with different engines. For example, Stride. And I want somehow to make the code also work in Unity natively without having to actually compile it to an DLL. We'll see how it works. I might have just spoke Spanish to you depending on how much you know computers. But... QASIC right here, the legacy version that we are using, is not finished. You know, for things like the input system, not that big of an issue. However, for things such as the settings, 
Oh boy. Oh boy. That it, it, it even has bugs. It has so many bugs. Just to put into perspective. This code is responsible for saving a single piece of string. That's it. We require so many different methods and so many different things to set up. And for why? Why? Because I made, well, I made it while I was drunk. No, seriously, these things are horrible. Like, or generally, how it's supposed to work is that we have this thing right here. Option setting, comparison, cache, location. That's it. And that's it. We don't need all of these. Nobody cares. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. Because how it works is like this. So, a task such as a shortcut preferences tab. Yeah, sure. Might be simple. But we will run into so much junk trying to navigate this thing. I am surprised how anybody would use it because I've made this. I know some of the code. I know how it works behind the scenes. So, if there's a problem, I can quickly debug it. But that doesn't mean it's simple. I get still a lot of issues. It still brings a lot of issues. However, there is one thing that we can make, and that's preferences. Which I didn't note into my little thing. Uh, how do we call it? Uh, comparison preferences. Okay, so, pretty much, we have the preference, preferences window. Uh, preference window. Right here. Currently, it's divided into a hierarchy of a single option, path of a single option, and other settings with no options. And I would like to, instead of having path, I would like to instead name this translation. Why are you so slow? Okay, I think it's the debug mode. Yeah, I took it is really slow, to be quite honest. I'm gonna give it a minute because it's gonna be, it's good, it's, it's, yeah, I piss off. Ah. Ah. So, because, yeah, this is translation comparison. This is the folder of the SL translations path. We're like, SL, oh no. We don't need to change the name of this. We need to change the display name. SL translation translations path. And then another thing we will add here is oh actually hold up in here. We'll change the name of path to comparison. Oh we are we are edging we are sorry, we are at the edge of the thing. Uh we have the translations path. That's nice. Then another option is if we want to, yeah, a toggle. And it's gonna determine. Buh, 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 buh. How do we name it? Tran comparison cache or use cache. And we're gonna. So, this option will determine if we want to actually sa save all of the exported files from a cell into the SLT SLTMF format, which is faster. Or more, not more faster, but it's just easier. Ah. I don't know, I still want to give people the, like a, a way of choosing because I don't know. Maybe they don't want to. Okay, uh, how do we name this thing? You, uh, use uh, use cache and now the funny thing about the window we don't really need to code anything because of how it is made if we go into preferences we're gonna add a new preference which is gonna be a bull target the element's name is comparison use cache and the target option is comparison uh, use cache 
Oops, wrong thing. So, from what I'm seeing, we also want another path, like this one. Oh crap, uh... We're gonna name it uh, Cash pa Comparison Cash Path. Cash Path. Yay! Uh uh uh. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, hold up. You change the name of this to this. Okay. And then we add another. This time a path target open and it's gonna target the option comparison cache location which by default will just be in application those persistent data path 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 edit preferences hey it work! Hey, 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 hey! It work! <laughs> Use cache, but why is it disabled? Is it not loaded properly? Because there might be that might be an issue. So, or maybe it's the problem with the translation. Oh, uh, problem with the uh, uh, settings system. Oh no, it just doesn't work. Wait, what? Why? Wait, but we can see that it is certainly what is a thing. Is it is it is it really using the cache? Use cache. Huh. Oh. Where do we use it? Oh actually nowhere. Also it might actually just be set to false. However, we would see it reflected in the settings file. Use cache true. Okay, so I am what? It's a problem in here. We have a bull target. It should just work. I think, I hope. Target option, target option. Okay, we're gonna once again attach to Unity. This is gonna make Unity less responsive. However, it will let us Look inside the coat and grab it by its insides and wiggle our thumbs there. Anyway, uh, once it actually compiles, I'm gonna drink water. I've started to notice like some problems with uh, bulls, but I don't know why is it not toggling. Why? Why are you doing this? Okay, so this is the target option translation path. We don't care. This option hierarchy collapsed default. Okay, let's see. So it didn't. So it didn't manage to get this. This is called true. Are you is T? We find ourselves the winner. <sighs> That's not how it works. Okay, so. The options, the options thing will always return a string. This will never be a bool. That's why it doesn't work. That's why any bool doesn't work. Holy garbage, my... I am smart. Okay, so we just need to... Instead... I remember I've made a thing for the manifest inspector. I think we're gonna steal some code. Manifest inspector. There, there was like a complicated function I used somewhere. Oh yeah, here con we need to get the converter of type T, whatever that means. We need to, if converter is not equal to null, meaning that we can convert this, and we think that this thing is valid. Then converter would convert. Convert from string. And what do you want from us? Why doesn't exist in current contest? Okay, yeah, sure, it, it's value. 
What now? Objects to string. What is val? I thought I'm confused now. Value is Tiva. Oh, I get it. Why is it returning an object? Unless it isn't. No, it is. Why? Wait, don't tell me it actually. Object value. Why is it treating it like a string? That's what makes me question. Huh. It's, it's treating this thing like a string. It's treating a bull, a boolean, like a string, and it shouldn't. I think so. Wait, however, how do you change value? How do you get this? Should I get setting value type? false and if it does returns it is okay let's see boolean it's called from here I think no it's not Boolean val. Okay. Current name string. Well, of course, it's gonna be the right parameter for that. Now we have a Cache location, well, that's also going to be a string. And we have a translation path. Because that's, that's going to be a string. Hmm. Clubs by default, and the value is set to. Where do we get the. What? Value type is a boolean. Why are we setting this to translation path? What? What's the name of the setting again? Hierarchy collapse the default. Har hold up, no, we need to we need to we need to get to the bottom of this. How do we There was a way to track these things in Visual Studio I forgot how to do that? You call ah uh... Crap, how do you preview how, how things get like what called what? There was a way to do that, but I forgot. A very simple way. Change option. Oh, here. Oh no. Load config. 
go to the preferences options controller initialize wait so it's but but you're just using the wrong value where do we get the value from change option change option and this is load config change option setting that value there are settings i'm really confused by this translations path okay yes sure that makes sense they are using the wrong value the keys translations oh no the keys wait the keys translations path why is it telling us a different key right here You tell us your name. Oh, wait. Wait, I know. I know what's going on. I know what's going on. Because it then checks for the name and the value type here. So it will do these things quite a couple of times. This is where things actually get loaded. Hierarchy collapsed by default. And the value is boolean. And the value right here is true. The value is set to true. Okay. And then user preferences. User preferences is string and string. Hold up. User preferences. I thought it was just two string. No, it wasn't. Okay, let's see. Well, this is this is normal. Oh, I'm really I'm terribly sorry for having to debug QA in front of you, but like that's just how we just this happened. Ah, <sighs> uh huh. I'm not sure if it's a problem with my code. I mean, it's of course a problem with my code, but is it a problem with target option transitions path? Okay, sure. Hierarchy collapse default value is. Why is it like this? Try get option value. Use cache, okay. Why is it becoming a string? Yeah, you see, it's a string here. Why? Why did it become a string? It doesn't make any sense. You can see that option name right here is comparison use cache. We're going to comparison use cache. The value is true. Oh no, it's also a string. It's just masking it. Wait, so maybe this loaded incorrectly. So we are reaching 8 a.m. Sorry, p.m. One second, I'm terribly sorry. Transition spav, I don't care. Cast by default. Okay, what is value then? Value to string. We set it to string. Why? Safe setting. But there's no point. Like, why are we even doing that? I'm telling you it will break something. I hope not. This might just fix it. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe that it breaks something else in this control. I really hate the option system. That's something I really would like to rework, but that's something that was not reworked for a very long time. I know, reworks. I mean, this is an SL themed stream. I 
his preferences. Ujiro Kata, it just works like that. Holy crackers. That was it. That's it. That's all it was. Well, thank you, gentlemen. Wow. I am so glad we've managed to resolve that issue. Well, we fixed that and we fixed another problem which we, I didn't even know it existed. So, upload. Preferences. Bull. Fix. Fixed. Options. Controller. Turning everything into a string. I'm dumb. Okay. But I think that's all today for the translation magazine. We're actually just gonna switch to SL. Holy crackers. Okay, let's change the stream name. Well, uh, okay, streaming. We're switching to SL. And let's actually switch to SL. Now, it's important to actually play the video game more than work on a tool for making the game because it's you can get you can get insane. You can go insane. You can actually go insane. Okay, we can close this, we can close this, we can close this, we can close all of these. Holy! My brain melted. I'm gonna now eat sandwich that I forgot to eat earlier. Apologies, but I would not like to die on stream yet. small little issue. Hello, welcome to Shmolesel. Welcome to Shmolesel. Today we are gonna change. The <gasps> and we also need to borderless window keep visible. <gasps> what kind of mental illness shall we load today? Empty. Ah, as per usual. Rent a server. they change the mappings for this? Well, I actually have to translate. Why couldn't you just translate it yourself? Why did you add a new entry? You added a new entry. Thanks, Esso. Thanks, Esso. Uh... I hate this. I hate my job. It is truly so sad to watch. We're just gonna keep seeing people die. This 
plugin prevents this beautiful translation from being even more beautiful by this text. Uh. Like, look, I don't want text uh, except this one. I, I I want this one for some reason. Also, there should be like a way to disable like I don't know wait timer or something like that to actually be able to toggle it because quite often I need to record something for video or gather footage. When I'm recording, I don't really want this thing because then it just kind of it's it's, it's a little bit jarring in videos. actually escape does he know no you don't know uh, MTF have 52 tickets and CI only 48 I can't hear them at all nice the old Weapons, yeah. uh, entrance and light Alright, thanks. You're spawning as empty up now, bye-bye. Yippee! Yippee! Morally strong adoptions. Aww. This is what you call ray tracing. Oh crap, I forgot I cannot change my attachments like this. Uh. In what way? I may have looked at them on 96. I'm not sure. I didn't see him. I'm gonna wait it out. Was it done? Morning six. I'm not sure. I didn't see him. I'm gonna wait it out. I just want to eat my sandwich. Bruh. Shut up. Hi, my. Any, mini, mini, my. By the tire, by the tire. Okay, goodbye, my. Okay, the Vault 106, when the, these things will reset. There's actually some strategy there. No, it's just like random. Perhaps it, like, what's the point of that room? It's pointless. And I really like all the 96, uh, sorry, 106, because in this pocket dimension you could actually mark a spot where you should go, but uh, then you could also do the opposite and mark a spot where you shouldn't go, and people would follow that spot, and they would die. That was funny. Especially if there was like a, you know, a, a, a body cleanup in the pocket dimension. I'm so sorry for See, according to the SL community, 
I'll say it. No. To the 096. Admirers. Or like the defendants of 096. This lad should have, in that situation, just go after 096 and shoot him. Now, he would have died, but he should have stick to his team. So it's, it's his fault. So he shouldn't have run. He should not run. just happened to my ping no. okay I just jumped up to 233 in their defense this would have actually probably done more for the game if he actually just went after 96 and shot him yeah at least I could deal free damage to him I was just pointless Isn't weird that I find making a translation tool for a cell more enjoyable than actually paying a cell? Oh, and my camera battery is dying. Ow. We respawn now. Oh, we're gonna be chaos? Wow. I couldn't have predicted that. Uh, thank you, Doug. And yeah. Yep, P as they say. That's not some graphical issues. Uh oh, it's like I forgot to translate something. Uh oh. Oh wait. Uh oh. Go Phoenix. Hello. Hello there. Oh. Hey, what's up? He might have just changed the translations and I need to look into it. Holy garbage. He might have changed translations. Like some breaking way. That wasn't very nice. 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 No, but I'm seeing this. Hello. Can I go to shop? Hello. So, drop an item. That's worth. How does this work? Yeah, you drop one item and grab another. If it's an expensive item, you need to draw the same worth of items. So you can't just what will I get for this? And then grab yeah, it's golden. It's golden. It's golden. Oh, yeah, that's good. What will I get for this? Stuff. You can, you can get Something. stuff. I mean, she was something. Okay. I'm gonna get a gun and ammo for the gun. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. Bye bye. Oh, boy. Yeah, so, this is the first time in my entire life where I actually engaged in one of those role plays. I never, I always could, like, I, I, I hate it. Why do so many people do it? Also, my camera died. Means I can now. Disable the lights. Yay! My eyes will finally not hurt me. Oh, 
Why ain't that? Ain't that pointless? Oh, there was a ball, ball to the little death. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a nice item. I should now grab it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, you did. Uh, I don't know what you did. I cannot hover over your ragdoll because I made everything invisible. Uh, also, I feel like I ran out of items. Uh, uh, thank you for your service, whoever you are. Oh, shut up. This is pointless. However, this is not pointless. This is useful. Will I get the cool overpowered gun or at least the, the gun that people call overpowered? No, I won't. Wow, they really messed the translation. So something is really messed with the translation. They messed something up with the translations. Wait, no, hold up. They managed to... What is going on? Okay. I will need to make a GitHub repository to track all of these things, because, wow, I, I have no idea what's going on. Why are the translations behaving like this? You see, like, some chaos classes, I'm not sure you will be able to see it here. No, because there aren't any, uh, there aren't, uh, uh, there are no longer those that have it. Some classes just have, like, a dash, for no reason, meaning that it's a blank translation, which is not tracked by SLTM. And I don't know why is it not tracked by SLTM. Nice. Man, I, like I've started to kind of, uh, you know, I've started estimating how long it will take me to make the next video and currently like the biggest thing that's the biggest uh, th uh, thing right now on the list is, well, making SLTM and most of the other things, they shouldn't really be that difficult. I know there are a couple of things I still haven't figured out, but they shouldn't be that difficult to make. Which on one hand, like, I'm even starting to now think about 
Hey, uh, maybe I should do something different, more advanced, because this seems a little bit too plain. But I'm just gonna keep it simple right now. I'm sorry, uh, like I have this... Uh, in Poland we have a Matura exam, and that's coming close in, like I think, two months. And I don't know how much time it will take away from me able, being able to work. I'd probably like to get that finished before that. Mostly because I have a plan after that exam, because we get like a lot of time in Poland after you make, like, write that exam. You know, like, depending on how you write it, you can have infinite time, or you could, you know, die. It depends, you know, it always depends on the situation, but... Chaos have tickets, uh-huh. And I have like an idea for a project. I need to use uh, to make during that time. Nice. Yeah, that was amazing, honestly. That was a really good grenade. Wow. Shotgun. Six months. GG. Shut the fuck up. Nice. Shotgun. JJ fellas. Press escape to disconnect. We shall. We shall. Oh, 13, 15, 16. 15, I got a really 16, 17. I need a really. It's guys, can you say cheese? No. Uh -oh. Fuck you. No, we did not say cheese. Milk. It's clearly 19. needed for a shop. What? Nisha. Are, no, 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 no. Are you Chinese? Are you Chinese? No, no, no. I think I'm going insane. No, no, no. As per usual. Nom 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 hello 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 hi the only time i guys wait a second why am i in light containment bad news i am i am coming to call you all i have Run, run away for your life, run away. was more than two years ago. Run away, I'm coming for you. Alright. Okay, so I guess I'm Hello. lost. I heard a Tesla. Do you hear me? Ah, shit. I heard a Tesla, I'm walking in a Tesla. Attention, all personnel. You walk in a Tesla? What? Uh, someone already went through uh, a light checkpoint. Guys, do you like shawarma? Does anyone like shawarma? No one? Uh... <laughs> I have a match to escape. Well, that sucks. Uh, there's a couple of people that went too heavy. He's looking at me. He was, like, how was he able to look at me from behind? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, I suck. Be free. So. Man, I suck. You 
probably Hello. Be on I am behind you. I am behind you. <laughs> Why do I suck so much? Holy garbage. Up one cent for is an incredibly easy SP to play as. Run away. I'm don't, struggling so much. Don't kill the guy who Why did to me. He, he what? has a shop. He's the shop. Of I was in the middle of the board. Ah, come on. The guy over here, over there, is a shop. Oh, you don't kill him. Yeah, Actually, yeah. He was yeah. Hello. A bird guy. He hello. Needs some stuff. I'm gonna I'm uh, go report this to the shop. He needs stuff. Chin Chan Chong. Them children getting me killed. It's always the fucking children. Fucking. Nice. Do you want to the gun here? Nah. No, don't kill him. Nah, nah, go, go, go. Okay, go away. Go away, go away, go away. Okay, go away. Do you want me to kill you or not? If you don't, just go away. No, 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 no. Uh, you kill him. Also, help me out. I'm in here. Again? I'm in there. How did he look at me from behind? Fuck. I wouldn't have noticed him. Open the door. Have a good day. What Come is on. going on? Have a good day. <laughs> I'm asleep. No, you must don't. I can't do shit, I'm locked! Haha. <laughs> Where are you, luck? The box. Hello, I am behind you. I mean, I mean the small armory. That was not nice of you. Oh, no. yeah. I feel lonely. Hey, Fiona, can you fuck off? Come on. No, no. Come here. Come here. Oh, hey. Guys. That's crazy. It looks like I am... I, yeah, I got trapped because of a... Oh, come on. I can close this thing. Seriously? Yeah, no, you can't close it. Why? Yeah, just I'm don't having waste your fun. Time on it. Yeah, me too. This server is broken. Looks like the server is almost empty. Shit. This is three, so sad. I have to kill a couple of people in uh, life. I'm gonna go to heavy now. Run away, run away, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. And now I'm gonna rush you. Don't do it, don't force me to I do it. Fucking stuck, I I'm gonna rush him now. I'm sorry. I have to do it, sorry. Hey. I was gonna kill him anyways. Don't do it. No, no, no. Fuck. No. Well, there was no, do not lie no. when you open that shop. That is not acceptable. How did you miss me? Then I don't know, I suck. Yay. GG, bro. <laughs> Hello. Please. I'm not Hello. trusting anybody. I'm oh. no longer trusting anybody in opening a shop. I am the only shop man. Why did you shoot me first? Oh, I'm just fucking tear. Hey, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Why fuck away? Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough, okay. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hmm? Oh. This was going loud. Things you do for closing doors. Run away. Uh, 
out of closing doors. Oh, I found the ashes. You couldn't tell. This is this is so overpowered. I call you guys, but I like the story that first because it was created but man. Here, I know die. Although I am half held. Well, I got one zombie, but that's about it. Ah, I see. Probably gonna die. I'm gonna do it for the what? Oh fuck right. Oh, this is really difficult. Ah, still managed to do it. Eh. There is only one human remaining. Where shall he be? We will never know. If we die. So let's not die. Hello. 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 Ah, how much I love single target remaining. Lovely. Hey, but we fixed it. Do you still have your SCPSL clone file? Yes, I do. Oh, hey, I oh. Look at Make it public uh, now. Uh, uh, sorry, but that's not gonna it. happen. I'm not sure. Oh, he's self-conscious. Okay. Yeah, I, th I, there might be some sensitive things there, and also. Brown. Apologies for being selfish, but I don't want to. <laughs> I found the last MTF. He has the overpowered gun. He's at 106 chamber. Okay, D. Oh, fuck, you made it! Okay, GG. You're a boss, screaming at me. Yay! Yep. Yeah, <laughs> I know, like, there are other people that would probably learn something from that, but honestly, like, it's, it wasn't a good project. I also used some assets, temporary assets that were from, like, stolen from a cell, even. So I really don't want to make that public. Can you show us the project? I'm gonna open the shop again if you can. Uh, the I'm not. I don't think I have the right version of Unity installed, but I could okay. after the stream, which I think we're gonna finish in like 24 minutes. Let's say. 
Just, you know, just another specific you're number. Capitalist. Fuck you. Yes. Real show Z. But then again, no, I'm a little more trade. You oh, trade okay. Also, why you don't have text? Equal to it. Uh, don't worry. Yes. It just happens sometimes. It just happens. Hello. No pop up. No. This config is amazing. Yeah, maybe that's LTM, of course. <laughs> Hello. Ew, a nerd. This, this should be a base game. game. Oh my god. Should be in base game. Ah, shouldn't. Like, there should be an option to just skip those intros. I gotta see, like, I, I always think that they are way too obnoxious. Let's punch a scientist, punch a scientist. Punch him. Hello, are you gonna sit inside the box? Don't be contained. Let's contain him. D-boy, out of the cell, you will not be in touch. Mech's not gonna break that, Come on, get that, D-boy. I will escape. He escaped containment. Container breach, container breach. Containment breach a lot. Now this is 097, it's the No. Button. I run away. No. Nine twelve. Yes. Open the door. No, there was a police. You have to keep just one. Yes. Oh, I got left out. <laughs> okay, I'll I'll pry it open with my bare hands. Boom. I just uh, my bare hands. Yes, you go. Very yeah. fine. There's so many of us. But why why can't we just punch him, man? Let's out to the game. I want to punch a scientist. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> why can't we punch him? <laughs> I want the lottery. <laughs> Anyway. Yeah, that's a clone project was... That was interesting. I like, sometimes I would get really bored. I get, I've worked on it for so long, so there, there are like different... Types of code there? I don't know how to call it. Are you still here? Doc, I seen leaks for next update and it's crazy. Uh, I don't care. <laughs> you see, I... I am... sad. <laughs> Northwood is adding the thing. Wow. You mean the thing? Like, the thing- Oh, I, I am amazing. The thing thing? What? No. Impossible. I don't believe that. Yes. <gasps> they are adding Skibi to toilet. Wow. Skibi dub dub yes 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 yes. Skibi dub 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 yes yes yes. I still forgot to adjust my microphone settings on this thing. I keep forgetting. I have a photo, do you wanna see it? No. <laughs> yeah, honestly, like, as much as I don't respect Norfolk's way of going about you know publishing updates about their, what they're working on like they no just check it it's funny no https colon slash slash cdn dot discord app dot com slash attachments slash one two oh three oh four four six are you seeing how much you're not serious about this i don't think this is an actual leak okay let's check it out then 
If not, then we are gonna sneak something. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Cool. I mean, why is it Russian? <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, we. Skiba, <laughs> yippee. Yippee. I'm not Russian, but I use Russian leaks. I use Russian leaks. Oh, leak? Oh, was that an actual leak? Oh. something that people did not have access to. Yes. Ah, uh, why? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't think they're gonna get mad at that. That is from Teaser Announcements channel. Honestly, you don't really need to look for leaks. All you need is a YouTube channel, a fan base, and a Discord server. It's In... not that big. <laughs> it's, it's really funny for me. Like, B. so many things. Like, I, I don't need to pay for Patreon because I, I get so many people that just yeah, leak this for me for free. Like, you know, not, not even like from actual leaks, but just. The purple roll. The purple roll. Well, I don't, I don't have the purple roll, and yet I know all of the things about the game. <laughs> I'm just that well informed. <laughs> Hello. 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 Please do not follow. I swear. Please. I nobody followed today. I'm so happy. Do not do this. I'm going to cry. Guys, RTX 3050 is. Vomiting face, vomiting face. Why is there 27 Dictas? Hi. Hello. RTX 3050 is like GTX 1060. FR. Hey, I'm just getting this stuff I wanted. Oh. Ah. Uh. Do you need a doctor? I'm just uh. saying. Oh, yeah. Uh, no. 3060 better. I swear, the, the entire the, 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 the SL has only one content, and it's in 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 that little shop bit. Holy garbage! Why? Why? No, no matter the server, no matter how much time passed since they introduced that new room. No, people will keep making a shop there. What is going on? Northwood is yippee. Northwood is nerfing guns. Oh yeah, they've been doing that for the last, like, six months? Or more? In Maybe, oh. I saw your video for 11.0. Old video, if you remember. Uh... Oh! Hello. Uh... Bye -bye. You talked about accuracy. Oh yeah. Okay, yeah, I remember. So, hey. I, there was an anorexic guy here. Hey, I've missed a comment. Imagine a friend buying 3050 and saying, "Guys, is this a good GPU?" Hello. Hello. Okay, uh, look down. Look down. They have to. It's not here. <laughs> okay, he wasn't you. He was. He was. He wasn't here. I saw him leave here. I saw him leave here. Yeah. yeah you yeah, saw? Yeah. You saw with your eyes? Uh, he was. <laughs> I'm down, I'm down, no, I'm I down. heard him. I heard him in you. He was turned away. Was he no skeleton? Was he no skeleton? There's a fucking. There's a shy guy coming, brother. There's a shy guy. I don't believe in shy guys. By the way, nice now we have three ghost here. lights. I have two ghosts and there's one on the ground. Maybe he's a skeleton, maybe he's Look a skeleton, watch out. Skeleton, no, 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 just, the, uh, just the captain gun. Captain gun. Uh, okay. uh, uh, should we just shoot him? No, you shouldn't. Why? It's, it's I'm at 9022. I got the MG I'm captain no, gun. No, 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 no. Watch out about the boy. Where did you see that? <laughs> Go fucking away from me. 
Oh, it's saying I have too many SP items. Hello, hello, can I sex you? Ah, no, no, I want to sex you. No! No! Okay, by the way, this server is dangerous because you can actually look at the shy guy even though you're looking down. Speaking of the devil. Yeah, he went on the staircase. Let's go. Is that easy? Shy guy has free HP. Where is the D-boy? Guys, where is the D-boy? He might have died. Oh, nice. Holy garbage. And my outfit is really different. Like, I always find it difficult to say anything about the game because it's... It's difficult to even put that towards but whenever I have an opinion that changes so drastically that's why in my newest videos you don't really see talk about the balance or something I might say like oh yeah haha game is unbalanced but that is it because those videos take so long to make say after I when I finish them my opinion uh, changes uh, doctor is also doctor is, in in entrance too. Entrance as well. doctor is I think selling zombie, drugs zombie, zombie. oh Nice. Just try to keep the cover. Let's not go there, don't go there. Don't go there. I think we should go there. Okay. Do I, uh... I think the computer is watching us. I don't think there is a computer. I don't know, I'm a specialist. I'll just from when you look. Oh, nice. <laughs> good to know, good to know. Light containment zone is locked down and ready for decontamination. Removal of organic substances has now begun. How to make someone follow. Tell them don't follow. Please don't. So don't press that button. Don't press that button. You don't you know you do not know what happens when that button is pressed. I'm enjoying my time. Okay, I haven't, I haven't experienced that today, and for a very long time. Let's keep it that way. Ahmed, I will buy you a car if you press follow button. Shut up. Okay, now when you're saying this, I am prepared for it, so it's not gonna make what such an impact. What happens if I do? Uh, don't worry. Just don't. Uh, bye bye. Oh no, jump scares. Warp. If you keep saying, talk about this, I will be prepared, so it won't be that scary to me. So don't. Also, I hate this. I'm not even gonna get revived. Nice. Oh, lovely. Yeah, about that 11.0 video, like, I... Oh... Uh, I Space free. I have no idea what that means. I should probably change the translation. I should probably just add it to the other. I should no, I should remake the translations. Like, since I have such new and beautiful tools. I love SLTM. I should put it in the description of the streams. Like a command, I don't know, like I see people making commands uh, Because like, I don't know, people can be bothered to just go into the description uh, Okay You know, the, I I don't know, I'm not a Twitch guy I don't understand the culture Maybe it is really difficult to check the description I don't know A lot of people on YouTube don't do it, so... Oi! You killed me! Why? That was mean! Why? 
Okay. I seen you in before. I seen you in YouTube before. Dark. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing that I'm most commonly known for. Man, I should make a video. <laughs> Surprise, oh, okay, is this an event round? Are we doing events? I don't want to. Why do we get two fucking pink colas? Uh, to be slower. I don't know. Why not? Get ready. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh fuck. See? I was prepared. I was prepared. I didn't jump out of my seat. Oh. It's not gonna work for me. Oh, did I? Yeah. I think so. <laughs> Three anti colas and one normal cola. If we had the, the other way around, we could call the sign. What was that? Oh, well. Shut card. up. What was that? I'm gonna make Kirby come for a house. I'm gonna give it some time. <laughs> Thank you for following Ahmed902. Uh, I you was think stuck so? in containment. Sorry. <laughs> He's a real person. You think wow. so? Also, Just wow. I wasn't impatient. All I have to say please is don't shoot me because I shoot so wow. you. No, no, I was farming upgrades from you. <laughs> wow. Just wow. What do you mean wow? Wow. Wow. That's all I mean wow. is wow. 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 wow, I'm not saying no. wall, I'm saying oh. wow. Whoa. Whoa. Fuck. That's someone asking me recently, oh, what games did you play? And I said, oh, my main mental illness is Secret Laboratory. And uh, then they responded, oh, what is it about? I, uh, how am I supposed to explain to you this? Grace, we just can everyone act them. What is that supposed to say? I don't know. Like a lucky coin garbage. No, it isn't. Mental. I mean, that's all. It's a mental illness. Okay, let's be honest. Nobody likes playing this. Well. We just do it because we are forced to. Tell them it's CSGO. Uh, yeah. Okay. Honestly, that's quite accurate. <laughs> It's like a violin, except that you shoot people. <laughs> okay, nobody will understand that. So I still go to a music school and... Doc, I need a clip for my video, can you tell me? How do you feel of how SCPSL is doing or the state of the game? State is... Uh... Yeah. Why'd I go here? Uh, how do you feel of how, of how SPS is doing or the say the game is at? Well, I think it is doing surprisingly well in for the state that it is in. I think the current problems with it is that the Norfolk is horrible at communication. We are asking them for many things, such as, you know, optimization, or I don't know, 096. Your state not good. Players say not good. I mean, it sort of also reflects on the developer. The players might, we might not agree, but like they are still players that play the game. Like, you know, we can have different opinions, but if they are the ones that play the game, then they, they have a right to their opinion. But uh, yeah, you can. It, it always depends. It's still always dependent on the server that you run into. Yeah, but I. It's, you know, it's this question is difficult for me because I come from like Mega Patch 2. The game was a different game. This was not SL. I mean, this is not SL. This is not SL. I downloaded. So, when you ask me what I think about the game right now, 
I don't know. I hate the game. I despise it every single time I play it. I get reminded of what I was taken away from. What was taken away from me. Like... This is not the game I fell in love with. The gameplay is completely different. Everything is now... Everything is now based around speed. Like, it's so difficult to escape a single SCP, not to mention you run into three of them. What you're supposed to do, everything is faster than you, stronger than you, and you know, you know, that, that's the point of SCPs, they're supposed to be stronger than you. But in all the cell, you, ha you had a way to counteract that. And that was your speed. You could gain some distance. Now? How? If you blink for a second, and I'm not talking about blinking with one cent free, but if you miss, if you, if you don't... If you aren't focused 100% of the time, you will die. Just because you made a small mistake. That's what I think of the game. Like, as much as I like to act nice and understandable in my videos, I am not doing this at the... Are they just the developers? They need to change some things, add new things. Yeah, like I really, I, I think SL is at its best right now. When it's just random chaos. During. Uh, Thank you, Doc. This what I exactly I want for the video I'm making, and it's titled SCP Secret Laborator is having an identity crisis. Nice. I was talking about something, I forgot. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I think like currently there is a... Yes, sometimes SL is a, uh, like a chaos simulator. And it's doing that especially during uh, Halloween events. I think this is supposed to be on fine. Oh yeah. And whenever, whenever there's a Halloween event or a Christmas event where there's just so many different things that they add that it's impossible to balance and you don't really know how to expect. I think the game is at its best then. It's still, I, I think it's still worse than what I would like it to be and what I remember it was. But I think it's a lot better. Of the game was based on Laura Kiewicher. Of, of if the game... It's based on more accur accurate accuracy. Ah, uh, honestly, I never cared about lore. To this day, I don't care about SCP lore. But, uh, yeah, I, I always... This is the funny thing. I have never encountered any game that would have so such an incredible gameplay. It's difficult to explain to me right, right now. But, but it was so tight back then. Yes, it was still a lot dependent on luck. But it was slow. You had to take your time. And you were always scared. Not because, oh no, there's a scary monster in the corridor. No, you were scared for your life. If you died, you could wait up to 10 minutes. That's what made people scared. Not because the graphics or the ambient. No. The fact that anything could kill you at any moment. And you would be punished so severely. That's what made it scary. True. And now? What? Well, uh, that what scared me the most. That scared me the most. What was that supposed to be? Dude, I did... Oh my god. What did you... Did I send you in here? Yes. You random... Oh, no, I was in this room and you randomly teleported me to that door. That... I'm so sorry. It's fine. You can jump at any moment. Do you think I should drink the cola? No. Danger. Light containment zone overall decontamination. You are a bully. T minus five minutes. I think it will hit the produce elevator and throw twenty balls.
Хихи. Nice. Not when that happens. Not even that. Why are there just random tutorials walking around? Hey, seriously, how long for Norfolk to actually rename these things to something that isn't a tutorial? I remember there was once an idea of custom classes where the tutorial could actually be changed into any shade or any color you would want. The custom name. That would be interesting. Yeah. Out of all the things I can think of, the fact that the game has changed, the fact that the game is different, the fact that the, that the game is like... I don't know, and fun for me. The the fact that I there don't actually like models for the MTF and Chaos. There should be different models. I mean they are kind of different, but, but I understand what you're talking about. But uh, speaking of it. Everything that I just uh everything that I just said that is not a problem to me. That's not the main problem. The main problem with it is that no matter how much we talk about these things, Norfolk will do nothing. And I don't expect them to like completely change the, the game. Like I understand, it's, it's a complicated thing. What? But I, what I expect from them is to answer anything, say anything. Well, that was pointless. Anyway, sent to make hell. Time to go. This is so sad. Oh. Oh. You'd be an enemy. The sewer is getting downhill. Oh, POV, you get reinforcements in Red Alert. <laughs> yeah. yeah. An enemy glider is carrying nonsense. Corrupted by capitalism. Holy shit. Oh no, it <laughs> killed someone. I found a gun. I did one time ask people working in Northwood if AK got changed. BC it's broken. They said it's the same as E11. I don't know about that. Uh, I know that a lot of things, no matter how bad the stats, a big part, what is going on in here? Uh, a big part of a gun that's, I don't like you. A lot of people neglect is that uh, the feel and the sound. Because if, even though the gun might have like incredible stats, if it doesn't feel good, people will automatically assume it's worse. Like, there, there was an example in history, I don't remember what the game was called, but there was a game, a multiplayer game, where people complained about uh, a certain gun. And turns out that I died. But turns out... Anti-cringe! Oh, that... Turns out... That even though people hated that gun, they, they thought it had to be balanced better. But turns out that that gun was just a reskin of another gun that was beloved for being so powerful. What's going on? Well, the sounds. They changed the sounds and suddenly people said, oh, that's an incredible gun. They did not change a single value. Has too much explosions. And for me, AK sounds that's true. sad. And the animations the are just sad. I don't like using the AK. And may good, yes, though. maybe, maybe it is like Epsilon 11, but I, that's not how I feel with it. He'll give me some pizza, don't worry about Imagine, it. Imagine like every single time someone joins the stream and just sees... Like, what is this? <laughs> what is this supposed to mean? C. C. For me, it's not the same. Whenever I need him, I'll just call him and he'll just give me some pizza. That's how it is having an Italian dude. 
That's fair. I've actually got I've actually got Mario and speed dial. <laughs> By the way, guys, did you hear about yeah, STP to, event classified? Have, uh, That's the funniest game of, of all time. It's it's an asset zone, but it's oh the developer. It's so fun. It's it's a horrible game. I, I didn't want to I, say I, this because I, I honestly like thought, okay, yeah, let's give them time. It's releasing in two months. Like he 11 yeah. feels faster when I, shooting, I, the AK I feels slow chilling. when shooting. No, I think he's chilling. I think he's chilling. Oh, yeah. Don't wonder. I said that. Yeah, it's talking about Evan yeah. Classified. That game is releasing in two months. They have a single STP, a single playable STP. Well, and it's the, and it's the stupid burning I'm man. We have keycard. We win. The video <laughs> Don't ask how I know him. Attention, all personnel. All you need to know Light is I'm gonna call him. Decontamination process. I take the adrenaline. It's fine. All biological I watched I tried playing the game during like an open test. It was so bad it forced my computer for like fifteen minutes. I don't remember the exact time, but I remember I counted. It forced my computer for fifteen minutes. At the press on, screen, buddy. after which I've only managed to Fuck. new oh. After which I've uh, I've managed to somehow uh, close it. Really, still had something unsafe, so I couldn't just turn off my computer. Uh, f thanks for that, by the way. And then I watched like another person. Oh, hello. I watched another place a uh, person play it, and the experience was atrocious. The game was so incredibly unfun. And then I watched another person play it. Let's go. And there was someone in the, like, sorry, he couldn't get into a multiplayer game. Uh, what are you doing? Spotify. Spotify. You could have said the old mom. You should have said that. I'm not sure why we went here. We have absolutely nothing. Spotify. 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 I got the gun. I want a gun. Hey, I want. This is a key card. Key card. Yeah, open it. Good. Let's go. Jed. That's such a funny history with Spotify. Like I always just say Spotify, and there's a backstory to it. It was like a, I don't know, uh, in Poland we have a lot of different uh, school trips. Just, uh, you know, the, the, just because the, it's something related with Christianity. There was one for, I think, yeah, but there was one of them. In, I, I, I had that in 8th, no, actually not 8th grade, I, no, it was the 8th grade. Open it. And we just went like a random place, we had, a, you know, there were like... Uh, Close it. Okay. Good. Uh, you know, it's you know, really not just we go to church three times a day and then we just water around. That was it. Uh, but uh, those. Uh, yeah, when we were at church, uh, it's it wasn't like a public church, it was like a private church. But you sound the exact same too, it's fine. Oh, 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 God. oh, oh. I don't have a key card. Just me, am I seeing something there? Do 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 do. Want to take a card so the gates might be opened. But yeah, uh, we had we had a couple of like uh, c c custom uh, crap. What is it called? Forgot. But you know, when you go into a church for like one hour. They talk about things. I pray. I don't know. I forget. And one one of the, uh, one of them was just like uh, you know twelve twelve st uh, stages of the crucifixion. I don't know. I don't really know the namings. 
in other languages of these. Oh, thanks, desync. And, and the, the, yeah, but it wasn't like a normal one, which would normally do. No, it was made for, for the youth. It was like, stage one. Uh, what's the Facebook, and he talked about how Facebook, oh, because you should be ashamed of using Facebook instead of looking at real faces and things like that, like this random garbage. And what, and there was like, stage seven, Spotify. It's like a really Polish. It's like a really Polish way of saying that. <laughs> By the way, the <laughs> his friends like sometimes you shouldn't listen to Spotify, but to your own heart. Shut up! You are. You are... Hello. Can they? Have some candy. Uh, hey, okay. Rosie. Me, Someone's gonna explode. Server room is a cursed thank room. You, BC you, every I enter exactly it, lobby, chase that got TP yeah. back and yeah. dies. Okay. Hello. Eddie, this is incredible. Hello. Oh. God, it's just like oh, hello. Really... I know. How Don't many worry, me and you forever. Is um, gonna green, take? green, now okay. row no, no. one, two. We should individually three. drop the candy that isn't pink. You can just say green. No, no, After a certain point, I think I will just be indestructible to one seven three. Yeah. Watch this shit. You look at me, guard. Hang on, oh, no, don't look at me now. <clears throat> oh, okay. Oh, I guess not. Well, hello. I, I think, oh my god. No. God, what is this? Um, candy. It's the candy convention. Hello, can you open the doors, guys? Oh my god, guys, yeah, can, can you open the doors? The doors? Oh my god, oh, this is a Wiki Wonder experience. I love candy! Hello, I'm caught, I'm caught. I'm like a god now. I have a gun for some reason. Hello, nice to meet you. Can you open that door? Nah. It really is! Please. Yeah, this is a battle. This is a battle. Uh, battle really Please. Peanuts on a um, surface. Right. Nice. Can you drop them in? Uh, thank you. No, maybe. So if I were to come for you, you could just summon them in. Maybe. You can try. You try something. I'm gonna go. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Bye bye. Hello. Why are you so pissy? Sleep disruption roulette. Oh. <laughs> Sleep disruption roulette. Keep running. Gotta go. Hello. What? What am I supposed to you do? Made it alive. Keep running. Yes, I am alive. I love living wow. and breathing and... Uh, were you part of the candy room or...? I was in the candy room. I ate candy. Yes. Oh. I have 27 oh, nuclear that, warheads that. inside of my stomach. Um, Where'd he go? Cause Gray's here. Oh! Got him. He's escaping. The one place that has not been corrupted by capitalism. Gone. Yeah, you should go in there. You should go in there. You should go in there, Nat. You should go in there, Nat. Nice. Yeah. Uh, That's all chaos. Yeah. I don't have balls in their inventory. Imagine being these guys. Sure. Hey 
Hey guys. Hey lads, how you Hello, doing? Hello, I shot six you know. No, turn around, turn around, turn around. Ooh. He likes to, this one likes to bite. How did I survive that? I don't know. I actually ran out of bullets. Oh well. I am useless. Alright, there's like 27 dead bodies in the elevator. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on on this server. Hello. They can't, the car is all mine. They're all mine. Go away. You think so? Okay, <laughs> okay I can't drink all of this. Quick, <laughs> help me. Hello. Drink all the code left. My god, look out. This is Looney Tunes shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's one of this conveniently placed trail of colas. No, I think I'm just gonna use Colas as a medical item. This is from Looney Tunes, oh my god. <laughs> Yo, does. Uh, why can I grab this? Why is there an item in the middle of two of these? If you took three and then more, it will be the same speed. Hi, I'm a phoenix. Crap, I don't have bullets. Let's go. How much health do you have? Oh! Oh no! Oh. You shall not pay. We took three, and then more. It will be the same speed. No, the, the limit is at four, right? Now it will be the same speed, but it still heals you thirty HP, which you know not a lot accurate, but who cares? Your phoenix did. I think I think I'm. It's just a thinkable thing. I just heard the CSGO oh. bunny hop music in the background. Shenanigans, shenanigans, really? Shenanigans. Shenanigans. Oh my! Getting getting really dangerous, huh? Getting really dangerous. Goggles. Yeah. Wish round. Maybe. I. I'll do wishes. All right. I'll get my list. Hell yeah. Good luck, yeah. have fun. Hello, hello, I am. See, Esco oh, Pop music oh. plays. I guess we're in the game. What do the wishes are at? I have to playing as Blank. <gasps> Cola! Candy! Candy's not spit in your mouth. Easy. Oh, thank fuck, you got that. <laughs> Eat up! Oh, he's got a gun. Never mind. Forget it. Let me let him out. I might as well open the door. I didn't even do it. I let you out. No, I want candy. I'll, I'll cuff me or I will sex you. Nah, no, <sighs> you can't. You're cuffed. Attention, all personnel. Crap. All biological substances must be this is not the outcome I wanted. This is this is not how it's supposed to go. Yeah, going, yeah. <laughs> Hello, uncuff me. Uncuff me. Come here, my friend. Come here. Where's the guy that cuffed you? I don't know. I started sexing him and then he ran away. A special, special item. <laughs> you gave me a Can I sex you? Attack. No. Uh, not everyone is the same. Where is he? There's no way he can run. We'll track him down. 
Don't do that to me, brother. I trusted you. I understand you. Sex update one. We don't need it. We already oh. have it. I mean, that works. Can I sex you? I want to sex you. I want to sex Kaboom. you. Ah, ah. I want to sex you. That's it. Ah. Panzaro. <laughs> the things players will do for a sex update. We just have a skid at link 106. Nice. I wish. Leave flight like, containment, there are fast Larrys. Uh, yes. You're fucked. So I'm just gonna look currently if if oh I don't see oh. any melons or giants. I don't see any melons or giants. I'm just gonna quickly check if I have the right version of Unity installed. You know what? I'm just gonna use the normal launcher. Someone asked me to show him code for my mental uh, SL2 that I worked on for some time. Didn't really go that far. That was interesting anyway. That project from disk. Let's see. Uh, how do I call it? I forgot already. Oh yeah, I remember. Oh, it's even pink. Nice. <gasps> wow, I even have the editor downloaded. Okay, that's... Wow. I think. Yeah, wow. Okay, that's possible. I can show it at the end of the stream. Someone getting farmed. I don't know what the situation is because I have a real muted. Yeah, oh no! <laughs> I've been cuffed, you fucking idiot. <laughs> I'm cuffed now. Okay, right, heavy armor, taps and gun. Oh, no. Hello, how are you? Use a gun! Oh my god! Um, you cannot touch me. You little bitch. You ain't gonna touch me, bitch. You're gonna touch me. No, no, no. No, no. You ain't gonna touch me, bitch. Get the fuck away. No, 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 no. You, no, you cannot touch CSGO. me. You, you can... CSGO. CSGO. What is going on this? You know what? I think after 8, 8 p.m. <laughs> should I? Should I? Should the administration I? personnel of the server is just giving crack and cocaine to do whatever they want. I could. But should I? That's the question. Larry been working out his legs. Yeah. <laughs> Unbeatable. I've never seen a guy <laughs> that good at the game. You weren't joking. Wait, wait. No, they didn't specify <laughs> Why that. so many... Why there so many zombies? One or oh, because so somebody is beautiful. Beautiful. make a shit ton of zombies. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> Do why are you? Why are you? We need you to tell doctors to get goggles. Who did wish for that? Who was the guy who wished for this? Uh, it was... It was Doctor. doctor. Right. Of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. Oh, yeah. Wish. Goals, you need to free them all. They're all stuck in the void. Zombie from Wish. Hello. Hello, Hello. I am in green room. Fuck it, we ball. I'm getting out of here. I'm so fast. Oh my god. Where's the Wish guy? We should wish for like... Yeah. We should wish for... <laughs> We're all stuck in the void, Goggles. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, sorry, okay. sorry. <laughs> when you play SCPSL at 3 a.m. Yeah. The ball is not in it. I'm bored. Wait. Wait, who's the one with the. Oh, wait. What? Beautiful <laughs> spectator. What? <laughs> Brett's wish was insane. Yeah. <laughs> hello, J E G B Yar. Hello, hello. <laughs> Guard flying around the map totally normal. Yeah. So th that's what happens when you leave a facility guard too long at 9.14. 
There are no clipping facility guards. Please come here so I can sex you. Oh, hello. <laughs> he was sexing you. He sexed me. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, we just wanted to go and get the witches. So now we've got to make our way to like containment. I remember today everything. I had a dream where I had a really good idea to try and get a witch that I still haven't on got how to I'm use to a maid myself. outfit for a video. And I forgot and I'm so mad. I don't remember, it was so in it's, it's just amazing. Yep. It even fit in the in like my current video style. Is MTF that good at sexing? Uh, it will appear so. No, please don't shit. So I how I just didn't even have to say anything he was already there. <laughs> Yeah, I wanna blow this place out, it's boring. <laughs> oh, Man, no. the new MTF division <laughs> looking nice. <laughs> this guy flying around and killing everyone. Yeah, that's my right. Yeah. Oh, I haven't pinged the. And I'm at 90.22, I do the same. Okay, it's replay. I was really. I was really confused. Dexter's speech works strangely. Okay, let's try out SLTM in, in practice. Oh crap, not this folder. Ah. Let's try out SLTM. Unity Projects, oh. SL Translation, Magismo, Source, This, Build, let's use the newest build because it's sort of stable. Okay, that's it's gonna be incredible. You're gonna see magic and beauty at the same time. File, open, oh, I, I don't have open recent here, I forgot. Translation is empty. Okay. Let's inspect teams. Actually, no, I don't need to. Wait, hold up. If I just export it, everything will fix itself. Oh, oh no, that. crap. Wait, no, I'm, I'm being drunk. I don't know how it works. We could try exporting. Maybe it will fix something. We're just gonna replace it with this symbol so we will know. <laughs> and now we return to the, the no clipping is... gamer. No. I am not kidding with that day. Probably. Uh, uh, hello guys, there. Why is there a facility guard hello, Mario. around the game? Yeah, I think we're gonna be finishing in a couple of minutes. I don't really feel safe. I don't know what's safe. I know we have no clipping facility guard. Larry, why Larry, does this man have a gun? Wait, Larry, Larry, you cannot touch me. Larry, you cannot touch me. It's a black man with a gun. Oh, I thought I was clever. <laughs> there we go, goes. You said you would. Yeah, you said you would. Go, 
Yeah, that's what I think. Ton. Alright, I think we're just gonna be ending this stream. Many of you are joining. Oh, actually, no, hold up. Hold up. I made a promise. Hello again. Hello again. I made a promise. We are gonna look at old. Old. New. We're gonna look at Project Armor. <laughs> Goodbye again. Goodbye again. I know. What? No. So. How's the unity? How's the unity? Uh, bad as always. Thing. Yeah, we're just gonna check out the cancelled SL clone that I worked on. Do you know what? Like, that's one thing I would like to try doing, but in like a very short time span, like two weeks. I think that would be fun. Just to like try to see if how would SL look like in stride, how much performance you would get. <laughs> how much performance? Honestly, I think the biggest problem would be probably be guns, but mo most things shouldn't be really that difficult to implement. Yeah, gun is a really big thing. Like, you know what? By the by the amount of shooter games, you might think that guns are really simple to do, but they are. Unity is ag. I agreed. That's why I don't use Unity anymore, except for. Okay, I do have to use Unity, but they still. Well, welcome to SL Clone again. <laughs> oh man. So, uh, not sure. Is, is the guy that asked for this still in the chat? I, I don't think... Oh, whatever, he will see that. Well, this is how the game looked like. You can see that I even made things like this. Connect host. Oh, actually, crap. No, not the button. Uh, I made, like, buttons so I could immediately go into host mode. So I just pressed host. And it just immediately starts. Just like that. Why is the sensitivity so low? Why can I toggle this? I think it's really strange. Oh, oh, the movement is really weird. Yeah, I made like a proper movement system. So I'm really short for some reason. At least I think. I feel a little bit short. So why am I rendering for a 4K display? What is going on? Full HD. Yeah, I c there was a working console. Uh, give items list. Item list. Help. Oh, whatever, we're just gonna guess. Okay, so I've gave, just gave myself a... Uh, whatever that is. I think that this is a medkit. I think. I'm not sure. Oh no, that's a keycard. Hold up, I know. That's a keycard. That's another keycard. And this keycard would allow me to... Oh, by the way, where are the... Oh, yeah. Uh, th there was like a first-person models, but they don't seem to be working. So I can't open this door, but if I have this keycard selected, I can open this door. Uh, it's a little bit broken, but whatever. Uh, give uh, to... What is this? This is another keycard. And this is a med kit. So now I have, give myself... You see, now I have 135 HP. Give free for... Uh, this is a gun, or like a very old version of a gun, so it doesn't really work anymore. And then give five. Oh, that's the... Yeah, this is the power armor which could actually equip. Uh, I think it was... Z oh, yeah. So how it worked is that you would just be really slow at accelerating, which would be really fast. So the problem is that turning around is not really that fast. What we need to do is go out of this mode. That was the idea. Of course, here, there isn't like a, any penalty to just doing what I'm doing right now. But there would be, like, it, it would take it some time and it would stand in place while switching through those different modes. That's an idea that was worth exploring. I was trying to make my own thing, not really make a direct SL clone, but it was like SL inspired that there's 12 people 
on the map. What is this? It's a clone of a cell, sort of clone that I worked on before I didn't. For you know, the Unity debacle started and I kind of realized that there's... Huh, would you look at that? You even have an equipment animation. Oh, that thing actually works, it actually shoots things. I don't think... Oh yeah, I was working on damaging, but I don't think I fixed it. And there's also this thing that is just says... <laughs> Holy garbage! Oh, this. <laughs> I said if it was good. <laughs> it's reload. Zero ammo. Can I reload? I don't think I can. Well then. And give eight. I don't think there's an eight. Yep, that doesn't exist. Also, I've managed to hurt myself somehow, uh, so that's interesting. Other items were there. Oh, I know that there was uh, no clip. Obviously. Which, honestly, that wasn't... Boy hand in the 11. Yeah, but these are like actually... The, the, the way this works is like incredible. This requires so much setup. Because it's like hands are one thing, are one object, and on that thing spawns another object. A certain ID. There's like a collection of different IDs that's uh, that get uh, changed together. So theoretically, if there are like server plugins, you could make it so that some in your hand you hold uh, the D class, for example, because it's it's all the same model. It was all the same system, so you could swap them out. Honestly, like don't make a game like this, but it was really fun. Like it's fun how it works. And then we have clear, clear constant, clear back displayer, nobody cares, debug displayer, yes, echo, exit, field, these are just built in commands to QA, so help, change input, change input, yeah, there are also keybinds that were saved, which is something that's built into QA6, so that's, that's not something I worked on. Change setting, yeah, that exists, scene, scene list, actually, why is this scene command here? It shouldn't be, because it's a multiplayer game. You see, it's game, prototype, systems. Since in the settings list, let's see at this. Let's look at the settings. Ah, it's just a standard thing. Specification. Let's see what other commands do we have? Connect cursor list. Oh man. Okay, I, so honestly, I still do it like this. I don't think it's a good way of doing it. But just that there are like multiple things that can say whenever your mouse cursor is unlocked. So I, I could have inventory opened and the console. So now you see I have uh, active uh, cursor states, inventory and console. And both of these would have to be disabled so that my mouse would be locked. That's how it worked. I still do it. I don't know if there's a better way of doing that. Do you have this player font size? Oh yeah, that, that's another DDFS, I think. I can set it to like 30. So I mean, it's really big. <laughs> Man, alt key basic. Something else. A disconnect, of course, give G attachments. Oh yeah, I could... Look, can, can I... List attachments. Holy crack. Holy crack. Wait, I have a dot sign? Let's, let's change the sign. G attachment. Uh, It's zero and it's... One, two, three, four, five. Or maybe four? I don't know how to... <laughs> Do you see this? Do you see this? <laughs> okay, I think this is really fun. <laughs> WTF. Yeah, I had a whole attachment system working. And they could actually modify values. The gun system was surprisingly... Uh, I mean, it's not good. But it was really advanced for what it was. I was working on guns for so long because guns take a very long time. Uh, help one, hold up. Uh, the dungeons heal. Yeah, I could heal 5 HP. Nice. Uh, heal host, of course, hurt. Actually, hold up. What happens if I do heal minus 5? What, it, what does it. It's the same thing. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, Cock Frankenstein. Uh, hurt ID. Oh, yeah, so there's this thing. 
Yeah, that, that, that was useful. Item model. Oh crap, I, I don't... Yeah, I think this command literally doesn't work. I mean, doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, seven hundred billion one. Yeah, literally, this 3. command hasn't been re-implemented yet. Oh man, I am amazing on my job. Mm, I am texture is also not re-implemented, but yeah, with these commands, you could change the models that sh of of your character. Like, you could... Okay, let's not try crashing the game. Thank you. Kill kills the player. Wow. Oh, there is even an spectator mode. Oh, sorry. Kill. Yay. Of course, roll zero. I'm a player again, and I didn't reset the inventory because I am amazing at my job. A list attachments, yeah, that we already did that player list. <laughs> Insert player name here. Okay, and final page. Roll, we already did that, and we could change the speed. Wow. Honestly. I am... I have way more respect for. I always thought about this game as like a, you know, a really unfinished thing that took way too long to do anything. But I am having way more respect for it now. Also, was it like F7? Yes, I could save it with F7. Like the technologies behind it was, are like really advanced. And like they are fun to tinker with, but I don't think they would be. I, I, I feel like I just wasted too much time on them. They weren't really that necessary. You know, like speed speed was actually necessary I that was really useful Steamworks. uh no this, i was just like you know still prototyping which is you know prototyping is supposed to take a short time this took like a year i think or two <laughs> so i think you could open these oh yeah you could open these uh, during a certain uh, time of development uh, there was actually a rick astley here uh, that was interesting uh, <laughs> Face bunch steam works peer to peer. No, I'm just using the. Uh, I'm just, you know, slapped in default and mirror parameters. That's it. Man. And it was fun to work on this game. There are a lot of, like, different. Oh no, there weren't many other tools. I know I made this thing. That's re I really like this. Uh, did I make any. Thing. Debug network manager. No, that was just an experiment. Is there a dedicated server? I mean, it's mirror, so you could make it a dedicated server. I even did that a couple of times. Like that's yeah, it wasn't a bit of an issue. Like if you know how to call the dedicated server in mirror, is literally just one button away. Okay, two buttons, and a waiting for recompiling scripts. Also, the way these scripts were. Managed, holy garbage. No, this was an actual mental illness. Oh, let me let me show it to you. Uh, let's go to custom network manager, for example. You will see the amount of different garbage. <laughs> we have a couple of assemblies here. Uh, yeah, they, they do. okay, so like this is mirror, like that's all me. I made all of these. <laughs> I still don't really know. Like, I think I I was surprised that you can have too many assemblies. I was unable to host them any other way. So what is this supposed to do? At this point, it's better to make your own engine with OpenGL. Yeah, but next time I'll make a project like this, I'll probably do it with Stride, and that would be more fun because it's you don't really have networking. You have a you could implement whatever networking library you want, but it's not like Mirror. You cannot you cannot do uh, crap, uh, example, uh, game, uh, combat, uh, uh, no, uh, player health control. You cannot do sync var hook, no! That's not how it works. You need to do everything manually. Which I find quite fun. Custom network manager, damage context, speed command, speed command. <gasps> All classic commands. It'd be quite honest, I always thought that making commands for QASIC was annoying. New QASIC is so much better than this. This would be so smaller if it was using new QASIC. Multiply by time dot delta time. Where? I was deltaing my time in the correct places, okay, sir? 
don't know how these things work. Up to them destroyed. Copy text. Wow. Game that admin. Admin controller. Oh man. Yeah, that, that was the Dutch, the only thing it actually did. <laughs> I spent some time on making these animations. Control plus A delete. No, why are you why are you saying this to my baby? In that combat, I worked a very long time on this. Holy garbage! You see this? So many scripts. I still I I had trouble with multiplayer because I was unable to shoot other players. I was really close to finishing it, and then John Ricatello said, "Oh." That's really sad. Templates. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Another interesting thing about the project. Uh, some commands. You know, SL has different uh, consoles. It has the main console and the remote admin. And the way I did it here is I had one console. Because, well, QAC didn't support that. And I also think that that's a little bit unnecessary. Why do I need two consoles? Oh, right. How about I make one that is good? C++ has trouble with compilers, but C hash is boilerplate. Yeah. So what I did was I made a uh, admin command. So what it would do, whenever you would run it, it would check if it is on the server. And if it is, if it wasn't on the server, then it would send that to the server. Or like repackage the command that you just typed in. And it would send that to the server and just completely ignore everything. And then if it was on the server, it would... Uh, yeah, it's like normally execute the command, but it would route every single one of those logs back to the player. That was so smart. And the reason why that's useful is that, well, whenever you execute admin commands, you don't really want to keep sending requests to that server. So doing it this way was really smart. I'm still really proud of this. I want to implement this in QASIC, like uh, in the modern QASIC, like as a built-in feature. It would be mirror integration or something like that. Because that's that is such a useful thing. I even made a different one for player. Limit the camera angle with 89.9 and minus 89.9 for vertical. No, who am I? A speech called laboratory? I know why some games do it, but I don't think I still need to do that. I don't know. It's like a change. No, I still doesn't need that. Normally games don't do that because you could shoot shoot yourself in a foot in oh, sorry in, in your foot uh yeah you can probably watch videos about that but that's Looking perfectly up and down is not that good ah i don't know i don't know i'm used to it change cursor lock mode what's this supposed to mean what is the oh yeah that was just like a simple utility script you're just saying how, like, in Unity, like, everything is component-based while in Stride. Well, yeah, there are components, but, like, we do everything by code. Get, a, get this out of here. Nobody cares. <laughs> Door. Oh, man. Yeah, was, I don't really, didn't really like how keycards were made. Oh, uh, you know. Honestly, I think it was good enough. Maybe I should, should have made, like, a different class for this. Also, I hate Mirror. Why do you make me do this? I never use this. Why? As access. Oh. Where did the time go by? Now I'm getting nostalgic here. It's a very nostalgic stream. Very interactive. That's self-explanatory. Interact pointer. Oh yeah, there was a there was a thing, for example, for doors. You could click on them right here, but also on the frame and on different doors. So the idea was that there was one object that was the actual door that would interact, uh, that would interact, and everything else was just the interact pointer. So when you would interact, you would trigger the interact uh, event on this frame, and it would send it to the door. It would interact with the door, like pass all of the parameters back to uh, to the thing that it was pointing at. Test dynamic lighting on some random light bulb, so it's like red in one session and green in the other. Ah. I don't really want to f change anything to this project because I don't think I've committed anything and I kind of want to preserve it in its current state. 
that the items inventory is not assigned. I used to check for everything rigorously. Like holy. No, seriously, ev everything, nothing would ever break. Which I kind I don't know, I, I don't know if that you should do it like that. I don't know, but I think I overdid it in some places. Oh, item. I so I could actually show you. Uh, wait, hold up, no, I did, I did make custom windows. What is it? Huh. Okay, scriptable objects. I will need to find it in here. Uh, you can see in skins, for example. Every skin would have a, its own, like, ID. Oh, and even the skin system. That was really complicated. Yeah, we could override different materials. It's like you could have a keycard with a different skin, and then that keycard would have its own like sub object. Oh, this is really weird how I did it. But is there like a um, items? Uh, no, not this one. It was in resources. Oh yeah, it was in resources models. Yeah. So see, for well, this thing would have a model loader. So the player would be a model loader, and that model would load the player. Oh no, sorry, there would be a model loader for the player and the hands. So the hands would load the model for the arms. And then the at arm had a loader for different items. So that item would load a different model, and that model could have its own different model. For example, a gun could have its own loaders for attachments. So yeah, you could daisy chain models. That's what you're saying. Really fun. Wait, there was like a. Is it, is it, is it, is it, there was like, I remember there was like a window somewhere. I made like a window for something. Even you can see the player models. Uh, so good, man. Even the D class. Hello, hello. <gasps> Wait, hold up. No, I remember. I remember. Project settings. Uh, game. Oh man, also you, you'll have to do this for some reason, I don't know why. Yeah, this is a list of old models, and this is the list of all skins. We remove duplicates, for whatever reason. I thought it was like a scriptable object for something. Animations, console, controller, presets. Uh, no, that was just standard gravity. Uh, that's input. Nobody cares. Skins, toolbox, URP. I swear. I custom window for something. Maybe it was in prefabs? I don't know. Oh, here, models. Wait, why does it have its own... Oh, no, 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 hold up. No, that's just normal models. Nobody cares about that. Okay, local. Nobody cares about local. You see how much of this is? Project settings, animation, items. Wow, so many of them. You see this? This is madness. Holy crackers. What did the player prefab look like? I'd like to see that. We had like 27 different thousand scripts. That's kind of how you do it. In, even a shell does it like this. Oh yeah, you can see it. And that's another thing I stole from uh, SL. SL has a component, a, a component called the uh, Reference Hub, which just references every component in a player. And I thought I could do it better, and I did. <laughs> As always. Uh, but hold up, where is it? There's like a player reference. 
network. Oh yeah, player reference. So it would instead just like make that list automatically. And I just made so basically I'm better than a cell. I'm trying to say. Model synchronizer. Zam. Man. So much effort put into this. So many reworks. More than a cell probably. Okay, nothing can beat a cell, but still. I swear, I made like a window for something. I don't remember. Or maybe like if we go into firearms, we'll see something. Where are the items defined? They must be defined somewhere. Little objects, items. Crappy medkit. <gasps> oh, here, I have it. Oh yeah, there was like a model explorer. We could select the model ID. Oh, that was really cool. Let's see how cool this is. You should be happy. There's no one watching. This is sad. I was trying to find this entire time. So I can select that for some reason. Uh, thanks, Unity. Machine gun. Oh. Yeah, there are so many different things I have to define. <laughs> E11 SR Stolen Edition. And this. Oh, crap. Yeah, that requires so much setup. It was really fun to work on this project. Well, thank you for joining my very sad, like, very nostalgic look through the old SL clone thing. Oh man, I wanted to make so many devlogs about this. I'm kind of sad now. Whatever, I, I plan on working on, like, a game, but it won't be, like, a multiplayer game. It'll be smaller. But for now, I'm working on SLTM. Well, thanks for watching. We see each other next week, probably. Bye-bye.